to this day. What's going on, everybody? It is your boy, Toe Tags. We're in the Toe in the Show, special Saturday edition. Last night, we was at Battle Club Pro. Fucking Annie up. My voice is lost. I was screaming my ass off. Me, me and Gigi, as always, are the loudest ones in the room. Well, we was outside, but we was the loudest ones in Brooklyn. Fuck what you heard. This is what you're hearing. What up, Ray? Ray was sitting next to me. <laughs> he stood there. He wasn't going nowhere. We trapped him. <laughs> What's going on, Ray? I, yo, I woke up this morning. Well, this afternoon, I was. my brother called me. I'm like, yo, what's what, 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 what? He's like, yo, dude, you all right? I was like, I lost my voice. <laughs> but yeah, we got a little bit of a back show. Should be on the way. He wanted to, he wanted to get here before the the intro. I think what he meant was the outro, <laughs> you know. But yeah, man, hell of a time yesterday. It was good good chilling with Ray yesterday. You know, good chilling with all the knuckleheads. We got to see a hell of a fucking show. But yeah, man, yo, it's fucking Saturday night. We out here. We doing our thing. That's the one thing. That's the one bad thing about being out Friday night so late. I got home. I got home at like. 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning. I ain't go to sleep until 4 o'clock in the morning because I had to eat something. And then I woke up at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> so my day, my Saturday was, was gone already. That's the problem with these two-day weekends, man. And that's that's one of the topics we're going to talk about today, getting older. Shit. When I was younger, oh, man, I would have been able to go to sleep at 4, wake up at 8, had the whole day, all the energy, not worried about shit. I'm still tired. I'm still tired, see? I'm worn out. I'm getting too. I'm getting too old for this shit. But yeah, we'll we'll talk more about that shit when when show gets here. But yeah, man, we got we got to let them know, Ray. We got to let them know how we do up in this shit. It's on uh, TitleMatch.net or Title Match Wrestling. It's on one of them. You know, if you follow us on social media, you can go. Title Battle Club Pro has been tagged on almost everything. You go on there, you can. I know where where you can catch it if you didn't catch it live. Dope fucking show. And we out here, and, we, and I'm I'm gonna be the first podcaster to have no voice and go and go forty minutes with y'all. That's some Rick Flair shit. Woo! <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I could I could turn anybody into a star. Nah, man. But yeah, fucking dope. How y'all doing tonight? How's y'all weekend been going so far? I yo, I made get this shit. I made one pancake today. And I did what they said. It was a third cup of the mix and one fourth cup of water. And I mixed it all together. And it's supposed to make two four inch pancakes. And I made one <laughs> one pancake. And I was like, All right, fuck it. If this is how you want to treat me. Well then this is how we're gonna go. This is this is what we're gonna do. Fuck it. Yo, last night was yo, last night was 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 definitely a vibe. The only thing that I forgot, we didn't get a pick together, Bray. Next next time we're gonna have to get a pick together. We got a pick with um Mark Quinn from Private Party, which is fucking dope. My man my man Ray said that he's friends with everybody in the rest industry and he proved it. I was like, oh shit. Sonny, what's going on, Sonny? Fire the show. Word. We're going to have to fire the show, man. We're going to have to fire the show because the only way he could get here on time is if I if I fucking record him and then I be like, yo, yo show, you're going to be here on time? He always like, yes. but he never shows up. He never, ever shows up on time. What's going on, Sonny? How you doing, bro? Yo, you going to have to come to one of these events with us, man. I can't keep losing my voice. I was thinking about it as soon as I got home. I was like, damn, yo, word. Take a pick with everybody else. Shit. But yeah, man. Fucking definitely, definitely a vibe. What's going on, Sonny? How you doing? Yo, you still doing your, your, your painting on Twitch? I haven't seen you. I know you was on Mixer, but I haven't seen you on Twitch in a minute. I haven't seen none of y'all. Y'all, y'all was doing your own podcast for a while, and then you was doing the... He was doing the um the paint. I know I mix it, but still, I haven't seen you in a minute, man. What happened? All right, yo, definitely. Um, Friday we're doing one in the Bronx. Um, right next to the Ortiz Funeral Home, off the Sixth Train. Matter of fact, 
It's uh, Invictus Pro Wrestling. Hold on, um, let me see if I can get the fly for you. But yeah, we're gonna do one on Friday. Shit, man, so far it's every week. All right. Now, I know we supposed to be sponsoring, but they haven't. St. Helens Church, uh, St. Helens uh, Catholic Church. They're having, um, yeah, I got to talk to Gigi because I know we sponsoring some shit. My bad. I'm, I'm over here trying to, yeah, this is the, this is the flyer for it. Yo, word. Yeah. So St. Helens Catholic Church, Homestead Avenue, Bronx. That's a ladder match. They got a this said money in the bank type ladder match, but it's some climb for the clout. So they get to cash in that that briefcase for any title that they want for up to a year. The dude who won it last year is actually cashing in his title shot this show. So that should be fun. PJ Savage, he's a dope dude. We had we had him on the show a couple weeks ago. We had B uh Jay Bougie on the show a couple weeks ago. Jared Diaz, we had on the show a couple weeks ago, even though that motherfucker stole my birthday. You know, we trying to get fight or die up in here. The, the scheduling conflict, but it's, yo, it's, it's dope. It's fun, man, because you get to fucking interact with these people. You can talk shit as much as you want. I was talking shit. I was screaming my ass off. Shit. I was turning around the ray. I'm like, yo, how come I feel like I'm the only one screaming right now? <laughs> but yeah, man, it's it's dope. It's, it's it's fucking dope. That's that's one of the wrestlers that we be going to all the time, right? Janai Kai, she be she be wrestling there also. The stickers from some of the wrestlers that we got there. Got the GG for the win sticker here. I gotta put this in there. I gotta re I gotta redo my sticker shit. But yeah, man. Fucking. It'd be crazy out here. How you do? I know Ray. Ray's chilling because he wasn't really. He was clapping, but he he was almost like, "Nah, I know the deal. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lose my voice. I'm not a rookie at this." Ray set me up. All right, cool, cool, definitely. Yeah, man. Usually it'd be like me, Gigi, Kenny, the kids. We got another um, Ray B there. We got the Dirty Heels. We, yo, we, we get a section and we take over. Now, yo, how's your voice kind of gone, man? I ain't hear you say shit. <laughs> nah, fuck with you. Nah, but it was... Yo, word, man. I got... I had stickers. I don't know where the fuck... I know I gave them out in the last Invictus show. You gave them out to everybody. Show fucking put one of the stickers on the bus stop, and I guess whoever cleaned the bus stop or just some cocksucker took off the sticker, and now it's stuck to the floor. But it's dope though, cause you when you when you walk to, down the street, you see the sticker, you see the the sticker on the floor. So you're moving on up, man. There's only there's only up from there. <laughs> Once you hit the ground level, you can only go up. Shit. Yo, Sonny, I be having I be having some of the women wrestlers to tell me to shut up, which is actually kind of dope. You know? I know you know what I'm talking about, Sonny. Shit. I don't know. I, I, I don't know where what the website I got the stickers were at. I gotta find them. But um But yeah. If I can find the if I can find the website, as a matter of fact, let me see if I can find it in my email. I'll send you the the website that we use because it was like a promotion. Okay, I guess it wasn't that. All right. 
Oh fuck it. Yeah, it was a promotion or some shit that we that we used, but this is the problem when you when you sit here and you and you're like, oh shit, I forgot I had to do all this shit, and then you try to do all this shit when you when you're live. Yeah, let me see if I can find that that website for you. But yeah, man, yo. It knows sucks. I know I know Sunny knows about it. I, I know Ray knows about it. I know Show knows about it. But getting old sucks, man. And I say this because I'm only 35. But when I was younger, I didn't think I was gonna hit 30. Like I was questioning if I was gonna hit 30 or not. So I would not care about shit. I would, if I was hurt, like if I if I if I sprained my ankle, I got up and I kept playing, and I just fucking let it swell up and and just kept playing, and it was like, all right, you see, that's it. It, it got better. But if I, but now when I'm walking <laughs> out of nowhere, the fucking. My ankles would just start hurting like a motherfucker. It would just start hurting like a motherfucker. And then it would stop. Yo, Ray, uh, where you at? Here. I found a website. I sent it to you. But yeah, um... Yeah, man, now I I walk down two blocks, my ankles start hurting, like I can't even walk, and then I stop for a little while, and then it's back to normal, and it's like nothing ever happened. I'm like, what the fuck is this? And my wrist be killing me, like, yo, dude, I gotta look like a professional wrestler to lift weights. <laughs> I'm not even, I'm not even fucking with y'all. I have to look like a professional wrestler to, to, to lift weights. Now, before, I was, I was doing it, everything was alright, now... My elbow be killing me. My wrist be killing me. My fingers be killing me. My fucking... My ankle be killing Like, I have uh, wrist straps and and elbow sleeves so I could so I could bench or curl. I gotta... I'm probably sure I gotta get, like, an ankle support or some shit if I wanted to fucking squat. <laughs> yeah, I don't... I don't need knee braces yet. I used to have the knee sleeves, but I don't need those yet. Good thing for that, but, but yeah, man. It gets crazy out of this motherfucker. I don't... I don't like it. But it's sometimes it's, it's some shit you got to do. You know? And, you know, so like I was saying, I would go all out. And, and you, you sit there and you pay for it when you get older. Which which makes me think like yo, I thought we were supposed to heal when we were younger. Like you know what I'm saying? Like oh, when you're young, you heal fast. If I'm paying for what I did when I was younger, then I'm not healed, right? That's that's not that's not that doesn't sound like it's healed to me. That just sounds like the pain wasn't there. You know what I'm saying? Like because if I healed, I should have been healed, healed, like not semi healed, like fully healed. And I should have been on some, all right, bro, you don't hurt no more. I don't know what the fuck's going on here. Why is there a problem? You know? Why is there a problem with this shit? But this is the way the cookie crumbles. You got to... You got to sit there and, and live off of bullshit. That's, well, all right, we're going to a fucking rant now, but this, this is why I don't like listening to fucking bullshit. Yeah, and your, your shoulder's still there. But, even, but you, should, you should check that out, like, see what you can do to fix it, because like I said, man, I had two shoulder surgeries, my right shoulder and my rotator cup, my left shoulder and my labrum. And 
my right shoulder is stronger now, but I still can't throw like like I used to. And I'm pretty sure if I was training and rehabbing in the form of throwing shit, it'd be probably be better. But you don't want to live with arthritis and all other shit when you know get when you get older. Because you set that shit off now. Like I said, man, it gets worse when you get older, even if it's you. But that's why I don't like listening to fucking people. Because people tell you like, oh, if you do this, this is what's gonna happen. But it's like, yo, but you, you motherfuckers can't tell me what's going on now. Like, you sit here and go, yo, this thing will heal in six months. All right, so why is it that when I'm older, that same injury I had when I was younger is hurting me now? That's not healed. What up, Joe? What's up, Joseph? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not healed to me. You sit here and you say shit like, Fucking, um, if you turn vegan, all this shit's gonna happen. So how you know? You don't have hundreds of years of data on this shit. It's just all, I, I, it's all selling shit. Don't sell me. I don't like nothing. I don't like none of these motherfuckers. I'm tired of shit and I don't like nothing. <laughs> That's why I smoke Gandhi. Yo, people say that shit too. The whole... The healing effects and all that other stuff. I don't know. Sometimes you get dependent on that shit. Like, I can understand it helps with pain and all, but also sometimes you get dependent on it. I know there was some people, you know, back in my day, when I was younger, people would be like, yo, I can't be calm unless I smoke. And I'd be like, I don't know, man. I, I never had a problem with being calm. Like, you just breathe. But I guess you, you, you develop that dependency on it. That... That's why you feel like you can't get calm unless you smoke, whether it be cigarettes or weed or you know, your choice, some shit. Because even, like, um, like, I'm not addicted to soda, but I like soda. But I'm not going to sit here and go, yo, I need soda to feel happy and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I do need something to drink, whether it be water or whatever, while I eat. That's just because, you know, I got problems. Whether you want to call it acid reflux or just some other shit. Like, there be times I be eating. If I ain't got nothing to drink, that shit gets, like, stuck in my shit. And it's hard to fucking... Like, it's it, like you just swallow, but right here in your in your fucking solar plex, it gets stuck there. You're stressing me out right now. I got to get high. Your word. <laughs> word. Nah, but you know what I'm saying? Like, there's a lot of dependencies on this shit. People make up excuses for you to... to, to to fucking agree with them or live their lifestyle. And the the people who do it best are the motherfuckers that are money hungry, cocksucking bitches. I'm telling you, man, I'm telling you, if I were to get in shape right now, phenomenal body, and started making commercials, I lost a hundred and something pounds, and I look like this because of nutriment. And I ain't take not one drop of nutriment. I bet everybody was like, no, he did it. Look, he did it, and then do it. You know what I'm saying? Where everybody's like, oh, yeah, but working out and dieting alone isn't enough. What? <laughs> it is. That's why no matter what you take, you have to do it. You know, you know, you ever notice that? Take this weight loss pill to help you lose 25,000 pounds in a month. <laughs> you read the instructions. Take with food. It's meant to suppress your appetite. And then... Go with, you know, make sure you have a steady diet and workout plan. So if you wasn't taking this and you had a diet and workout plan, you would be losing weight and getting in shape without it. Like, I'm waiting for the whole, you don't like to do shit or you ain't got time to do shit. Live your normal life. Here goes something. Boop. Take this pill that helps you lose weight without any extra shit in your life. Or maybe, here, take this, the, the, this pill, drink a lot of fluids, and it'll help you lose weight through the... Through the, the, the magic of osmosis and all, all this other bullshit, you have, you lose 30 pounds in two days with this shit, just don't fuck around. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that's what, that's the, the thing I don't understand. Oh, this fucking. You're muted. You ready? I, I see you, you prayed up. I'm here. I'm here. Yo, Zach. Yo, Zach. What's up, brother? I know why 
that's your voice song? I got my voice on? Yeah. But I hate you right now. I don't know why. Is it on now? Now you got an echo. What about now? Wait, now? Now you good. Man. Now you sound like this. The oh, fuck, man. You know what? I think you just fucking with me. Girl, fuck you, Mama Webble. No, you know who it is? It's not a problem that I can't fix. Jared Diaz. The show reel is in the building. Jared that Diaz fucked it up. Jared Diaz fucked it up for everybody. <sighs> He's coming after you now, show. Most likely. My hair is messing up. My wife's upset. Oh, shit. Yeah, and it's all Jared Diaz. It's Jared Diaz's fault. Word. So to Jared Diaz. Girl, fuck you, Mama Webble. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, guys? How y'all feeling? Hope life been treating y'all good, Mister 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 Toe. I was gonna call you Mister Show. Oh my God! Anyway, Mister Toe, the voice is back. I see. I see you sounding good. You sounding. I mean, I'm, okay. I'm sounding. Yeah, I'm sounding as good as I can get. Hey, we are getting there. You sound like you're getting sick, man. But it's all good. You, when you sound like that, you sound like a like a radio host. Yeah, right. Cento cuatro cinco cente. Cento cinco punto nueve. See, see, it is, it is. I'm at work for La Mega, La Mega. What's going on, people? Who's out there, man? Let me, let me, let me get the, let me get to the, to the chat. Let me see who's hanging out. Let me see who's in the building. I see Joseph is in the building. Ray is in the building. Sorry about that. Leon I, I, the I, King is in the building. I, yeah, I, I see. Had to, I had to see. That they had, there must be a better conversation going on. They don't see I'm working. Where? <sighs> yeah, I do. I know. I got I to gotta get the pics from Gigi because she took all the pics. But we, it, me, Gigi, and Riley, were, uh, we took a pic with uh, Aries Carter last night. Very nice, Mr. Yo, Carter. Yo, Ray, y'all left. And Darius Carter was eating, he was getting a hot, he was getting a drink from the, the mixologist that was there. I I don't know his tag. So Ray put it let us know who he is in the in the comments. But he was getting a drink. We already spoke to him. And I was like, yo, give me a second. I forgot who I was speaking to. I was oh, I was talking to um the lovely lady that's always that she's in the wheelchair. You know, at all the shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, my yeah. friend, my homegirl. Yeah, I was talking to her, and I was like, give me a second. So I go back to Darius Carter, and I was like, yo, just wanted to say thank you again for allowing us to sponsor you and put up a match of the night. And, yo, I appreciate your work. And my man shakes my hand. He's like, yo, no problem. And I was like, oh, and by the way, I'm toe tags on Instagram. You know, I'm the one that's always tagging you and all the other stuff. He's I like, apologize for stopping. Yeah. He goes, okay. I, I always reposted some of my stories, but I didn't know who you were. I got the face to the to the to the thing now. Hit me up. Now I know who you are, and we'll we'll, we'll work out how getting on the podcast. I said Ooh. beautiful, and I told them Tipsy Geek. There you go, the Tipsy yeah, Geek. Yeah, yeah, I know them. Yeah, well, that's my spot right there. Yeah. So so I told them I said you know what it is. I'm really six foot eleven, but I slouch down because I don't want to overshadow y'all. Yeah. And he goes. You can't overshadow me, play, because I levitate. <laughs> and I said, I said, I see it. Like, I didn't see you step on the ground once. He goes, yeah, I'm like Magneto. I haven't, my feet haven't touched the ground in years. I said, I get it. That's why you had his shoulders above the rest. But you see, with me is I got to hide my, my height because everybody want to hate on me because they don't, they don't like the fact that I'm the tallest man seven in the room. Hey, little one. Hey. Hey. You know what I'm saying? So so he looks <laughs> he looks at me, he starts smiling, he goes, Yeah, so and yo, it was like we were he's tall. He's a tall dude, so I'm looking up at him. And we're going face to face and we're cutting promos at each other. It felt like we was cutting promos. and I in my head I was like, yo, bro, I'm not well, let's go. I got I'm a podcaster for a reason. I got a BS and BS and I can go with the best of them. <laughs> he muted them. He could swim in the now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Shit. With show on his back. 
You know, you throw me in the deep end and I'll float, baby. There you go. <laughs> My man was selling water to an alligator. Word. <laughs> That's right. But uh, but yeah, man, I told him that you're a huge fan of him. Oh, and, for sure. And he's he's like, I appreciate all that. I appreciate you guys, you know, appreciating our work and sponsoring us and all that other stuff. So he's a great, dope dude, dope dude. Awesome, man. That's crazy. I've never seen, like I told you, I've never seen him usually stick around. And it's cool because I understand the heel persona. You you really not supposed to be sticking around and give autographs and talk. You know, it's usually walk away. That's it. You know. Yeah. And JF is not the talk to people type. <laughs> yeah. So I I understood. I never seen him around after any matches. So. It's dope that you got to meet him. Yeah. You know, and then um, we spoke to Santi again. You know, I let him know he was having matches tonight and all that other stuff. And, uh, damn, I was. Oh, yeah. So I told Ray, I was like, yo, I can never find Darius Carter after the show. He's like, no, nah, he sticks around and all that. He's like, yo, don't worry. I'll hook it up if, if need be. I was like, all right. Ooh. And, yo, during the show. Guy goes up to Ray. He's like, "Hey, what's up? You know, what's up, Ray?" Blah blah blah. He's talking to him, and then, you know me. I'm ch- I'm cheering and all that stuff. And then that dude starts cracking jokes on the on the the match, and we're all cracking jokes on each other and shit. What up, Lay? Lay in and the I'm, building, baby. And I, I'm yeah. looking at the dude, and we're we're talking, and he gets up and goes to the bathroom. When I go to Ray, I'm like, "Why does he look so familiar, Ray?" He goes, "That's Mark Quinn from Pirate Party." I'm like. That's why he looks so familiar. And in my head, my head was like, that's fucking private party. You know, <laughs> like, I was like, oh, I'm back. You know what I'm saying? I was like, oh, shit. Like, cool as a fucking cucumber out in the street. So face was like this. Inside. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Man, poker face, poker face. Word, word. He came back. I offered him a tick, t- uh, tick, not a Kit Kat. A tick tack, your breast thing. I was like, oh, yo, bro. I, I told him, I was like, yo, we got chips, we got, we got candy. You want, you want some, some fishies? What's up? He's like, no, I'm good. I was like, yo, bro, come on. You, I know you want a, a, a Kit Kat. Oh, a he's, like, he's like, yeah, yo, I'll take a Kit Kat. I'll take it. No, <laughs> so no, I take it. We gave him a Kit Kat, and we was talking all the other stuff. Cosmic comes out. She's in the tag team match with the other dude. Remember what the dude that we thought was gonna come in and take the title from her with the mm-hmm. UK? She yeah. helped him out, so she was on his team. But they were going up against main event for the titles. So I'm cheering for Cosmic while everybody else is cheering for main event. She tells me to shut up three times, to- well, twice. Once in English and once in Spanish, because Hoche was like, yo, tell him again, but in Spanish. She's like, Cállate. And I'm like, I didn't even say nothing. She's just telling me to shut up. Yo, so, <laughs> so there's a spot where her partner gets beat up and then he runs to the corner and grabs her like he's hiding. Mm hmm. And I'm just like, get your hands off my woman. <laughs> <laughs> Security. Yeah. Yo, and he turns around. He's like, nigga, you got to be a man. I was like, word? Oh, yeah. I was trying to take my shirt off. And then Gigi's like, and she slapped the shit out of my arm, bro. Like, like if I was a kid, like, yo. Gigi style. Yeah, thank you. I already know. Yo, I already know my head, my head, yo, Matt Awesome chopped me in the chest last night. Gigi's slap to my arm was four times harder than that chop, my nigga. That, that's how hard she chopped my... She deaded my arm. She got the Ric Flair chop. Yeah. So when she did that, I was like, fuck, I can't move. So I stood up on the on the, on the the thing and I was like, I got a paintbrush, motherfucker. He said, oh, yeah? <laughs> well, I got the whole aisle down here. I said, oh, say, yeah? Oh, yeah? You want me to whip it out, big boy? <laughs> Yo, I'm me and this nigga going out of the door in the match. <laughs> Yo, it got to the point where I thought somebody was going to come up to me like, Yo, you're going to have to calm down. But yeah. no one said nothing to me. Nah, and I was like, I was like, <laughs> Matt, Matt awesome, Matt awesome. Not, <laughs> no, but you know what I'm saying? No, but yo, dude, Gigi, you know me. You know me when, when I fuck around <laughs> with Gigi. I know. Y'all this is why I only do it over the podcast. Cause I got to be there. Yeah. Uh, she, uh, she's 30 minutes away. <laughs> I sit in the middle because you got Yeah. Oh, no, she found me. She was nowhere near me when I said that. She just smacked the shit out of me. I guess after the get your hands off my woman, she's like, nah, I got to get, get it to uh, Snigger. She already know. They going to flip over the <laughs> barricade. Yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> yesterday was so yesterday. Straight. Yesterday was toe with no rules. <laughs> There's no rules. You almost, you almost took the shirt. I, I almost got this shirt, but there was one rule. <laughs> Put the shirt back on. It's yeah. one rule. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ray was dying in the back. Ray. Yo, all they, yo, all their kids was getting at me. Kenny's kids was getting at me. Uh, kids was kids was, yeah, they were getting at me. Yo, it was cute because was Kenny's cool. oldest was protecting Riley because she was afraid of them jumping out on him. So every time the dresser would come, he would like stand in front of her. It was dope. It was it was dope as shit. Did, uh, did she is Riley giving candy again? Yeah, she, yeah, she gave um some fishies to uh to the main event. She gave some to Matt Awesome. She gave one to Jordy Lee, which yo, there was a huge surprise because. We didn't know who the extra person was in that, like, um, that battle royal that they had. Dope. Are you allowed to tell us? Well, I guess so, cause they, you know, they, there's it's all over Instagram okay. now. So Jody Lee was the it was the surprise. Jody Lee and and Sammy Havoc were the surprises. Matt, Matt Awesome and um, the Pharaoh were the first two to start the match, and then they eliminated everybody. And we thought Matt Awesome was about to win, so he goes for the pin. No one's counting. And we're like, yo, how come nobody's counting? It's like, yo, Jody Lee was never eliminated. So they eliminated Matt Awesome. Jody Lee comes out and she goes to fight the Pharaoh. The Pharaoh grabs her and then Santi comes out. Cause because if you they have a YouTube channel now, like a YouTube show now, mm-hmm. Battle Club X. So the Pharaoh jumps Santi on that. So Santi's getting his get back. And he hit him with the double unhooked power driver, and Jody Lee won the match. So she won a title shot any place, anywhere, anytime. Later on in the show, while I'm over here distracting Cosmic and her partner, her partner smacks the ref and gets disqualified. Bing, bing, bing. Yeah, so they already ran off Cosmic and, and the original partner. So it was just that dude in the ring with main event, and the Scotter Ricans were already like ringside because they were they were watching out so there's no one interfered mm-hmm. Jody Lee comes out and goes I got the title shot right so the Scott Ricans are getting a tag team title shot right now <laughs> yo they, they picked up homeboy put him in that move Scott Ricans are new tag team champions <laughs> yeah man that awesome is new tag team. no 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 the Scott Ricans. I thought he was Scott KJ. Ricans. No, no, it's KJ, KJ Mack and David. We was had him on the show. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but then, then Gigi missed it, and she Gigi fucking sponsored the Scott Ricans a prolific match. Oh, sway. Where was she drinking? She was in the bathroom. Bathroom? You couldn't pee in a cup. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. How dare you? Gigi missed it. And then, yeah, yo, a, a fan came up to us. Well, a fan went up to Ray and was okay. saying how he, he appreciated our cheering. Because we was the, really the only section that was cheering like that. We was che- chanting for all the wrestlers. We was interacting with all the wrestlers. We were making fun of the wrestlers. Like, one wrestler was like, I'm going to bite your finger off to Kofi. And I was like, it's all right. He got nine more, nigga. And Kofi was like, that's right. I got nine more. <laughs> Yo, it was we was going at it with them. I was doing uh what y'all, what we usually do. One, two, three. It was all the sweet. fun stuff. Yeah. Yeah. But we yo, it was more like, dude, I went there looking for I was like, I don't want peace. I want problems. And after the first match, I was like, yo, I'm losing my voice. I know this. So I said, fuck Why it. You should always be. I, you yeah. just needed a couple of couple of events to scope everything out. Let me look around. Let me see yeah. who's judging. Let me see. Everybody's being themselves. They don't give a shit. They everybody here for wrestling. This yeah. is dope. But yo, it was one point where I was like, "Let's go, Santi," and I'm I'm saying it, and no one's saying it with me. So I said, "Fuck it," and I got louder. Let's and yo, and it it, it went from me cheering for Santi to me yelling at the crowd, "Let's go, Santi!" And dude, at one point, me, Gigi, and and Kofi were like. Scott Ricans prolific. Scott Ricans. Pro- we were just chanting for both. We was like, yo, fuck it. Wait a minute. Chanted, Kofi, Kofi was there? Yeah, Kofi was there. Because usually we go opposite of him. And he's usually loud, too. No, no, yeah, yeah. So, but, the, like, he was chilling with us. So he started a chant. But he was chanting for one person. And I was like, well, fuck it. I'll chant for the other person. 
So everybody was chanting for Dominic De Niro because the kids loved him, but he's wrestling A game. A game is the is the is the good guy in the match. So I was like, oh, well, you know, I can't let my man not be cheered. So they they they, they cheer for Dominic De Niro. I'm cheering for A game. The little one's telling me to shut up. Everybody's laughing at him, telling me to shut up. I'm like, yo, I can't get I can't get a break. Everybody want me to shut up. <laughs> like, what's going on here? Well, you could just let it happen. I mean, it happened to The Rock against Hulk Hogan. Nah, it's man, cool. not while I'm there. <laughs> Yo, we're not. I'm. I told Gigi. Me and Gigi was like, this crowd ain't gonna waste our time. Fuck that. We gonna have fun. Y'all niggas wanna shut up. Y'all wanna be quiet, and y'all be quiet. But we gonna be loud. We here for. We here for a reason. These are which, all people out there. Which match did we sponsor last night? I never. I don't. Oh, Santi. Or hey, Santi versus Darius <laughs> Carter. The match of the Ooh. night. He fucking sponsored the match of the night. I didn't and know he was going. Now he, I understand. Your yes. guy against my guy. Yes. We, yo, dude. He tagged us in a story today and goes, be like the Knucklehead Network and GG for the win and sponsor Darius Carter. So I put it back in my story with the circle saying facts. <laughs> it was dope. Dope. Oh, yeah. Auntie Lala? Ruthless Lala? She was pissed at Gigi. What the hell did you do? She was cheering for the Scotter Ricans. It was prolific. She's with prolific uh-huh. versus the Scotter Ricans. And the kids and Gigi were cheering for the Scotter Ricans. And Ruthless Lala turned around and gave her the dead stare. And I was like, prolific, prolific. And then I started chanting for Scott Ricans. She turned back around. And I pointed at Kenny and said, "He's the one doing it. He's the one doing it, Auntie. Not me. He's the one doing Kenny it." Kenny, seven feet tall. Be oh no, he got shot <laughs> by her already. He ain't fucking with her. Oh shit! I see. I see. I see the video. <laughs> he ain't fucking I see with the video. I see the video. Did you get shot by her yesterday? No, I got. <laughs> I got my ass kicked by by Riley and and fucking That's Matt. Awesome shot me. Yeah. What's the chocolate? I got a fine chocolate that my mind off the Yo, I got one right here. You see it? Yeah. Right yeah, in the, in the back. Same color. The light blue. Yo, Yo dude, it's funny because Jesus' daughter's beat me up. I like I got her in a in a hold and I'm just yelling. Cause this is at the end of it. When we meet the meet and greet. And I'm like, God back. And she looks, I'm like, help me out. And she just she shakes her head and goes, Nah, you on your own. I go to Mr. Black. I'm like, he's a ref. He don't like this. He don't like this. It's illegal. You gotta stop. He's mad. And everybody was like, nah, 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 keep beating him up. I'm like, yo, someone please, nigga, help me. <laughs> now, Mr. Black. Mr. He's Black, ref. that's my boy. He's One! The, he's the ref, Get yes. off of there. Don't be like that. Come on. Two. Oh, my <laughs> no, 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 God. That, Get that, in the ring. <laughs> who, who is that? I keep forgetting his name. I know Steve is the, the other one. Mr. Black is the one that, remember when he cheated prolific? He's like, One, two. Fuck you, and then left. With, oh, with, yeah. I know who Mr. Black. Yes, Mr. Yes. Black. I know why they call him Mr. Black. I was gonna say that to the, the Black. <laughs> 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 I was gonna say that. I was gonna say that, but <laughs> no offense, because he, uh, uh, as you can see, Nick. I am no light one. I need a lot of light. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, that, that's the ref you're talking about. Come on, get off the ropes, man. Yeah, you gotta the ropes. Yeah, get on. off the ropes. He did Dude. get off the ropes, man. Come on, come on, man. Get off the ropes. <laughs> he never seen threatening. Yo, yo. Yeah. Get in the ring, man. Come on, man. Come get off the ropes, on. man. Get in come the on, ring, man. <laughs> One, come on, man. Get off the ropes, man. Two, come on, man. Come on. You gotta get off the ropes. That. You can't choke him three. <laughs> <laughs> I can't help you out, man. This is legal. <laughs> yo, I started doing a chant for the announcer. Yo, what's it? Yo, Ray, what's his name? Furnace Fry, Sean, uh, Sean Kemp, the announcer, the, the ring announcer. He was yo, dude. He got the smoothest exit in the ring, and he he kept looking at us because the first match with Gigi's, but Gigi wasn't there. She was getting some JMO, so he's like, he looks at the, the he's like, and this match is brought to you by Gigi for the win. And he looks, and I'm like, she's not here, and he's like, he's like, oh, she's so not bad. here. You see, he says like she's not here. Um, yeah, and yo, Joe is like, wait, I got an announcement, <laughs> and Gino comes out, and he goes, all right, and now he's, Joe's like, wait, 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 I got another announcement. He gets in the ring, <laughs> he goes to, and he's talking. Gigi comes like, oh, she's here. The first match of the night is sponsored by Gigi for the win. 
<laughs> they waited until she got back. At least they did that because that would have been the second one she missed. What's going on with her? Yeah, <laughs> word. In the wrong time to pee, the wrong time to jam. What's going on? You should have been JMO. That's the first thing you do when you get there. Word. You JMO as you get there. Hey, you should have been peed. Gosh. Messed it all up for yourself, Gigi. Word. You lose. But but yeah, man, I started a, a, a chant for the announcer because every it, he always looked at us when we was chanting. He's like, see these, so it kind of felt like fuck it, that's chant for this motherfucker. He's like, oh shit, all right, I got a chant going. Which one was the announcer? Uh, let me guess, tall, thick, blonde hair guy, uh, colorful purple jacket. Yo, you're, you're you're right, except for there's no blonde hair. This two. Okay, yeah, not blonde hair. Yeah, he's always dressed to impress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Yeah. I like him. This evening. Word. Yo, and if if Ray was sitting next to us last week on Wednesday, I'd have did the same shit for that announcer. I just, I, I, I you know me, I'm bad with names. I know. Me I too. am bad I'm, with names. Bro, we alike. That's why I said, I know them by how they act. Yeah. Mr. Black, I actually knew him because he's black. If you didn't give me his name, I didn't want to, <laughs> I didn't want to, Represent. I wasn't going to say it like that, but once you call yeah. him Mr. Black, oh, the black guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See, like, I, I remember Cosmic name because one, it's one syllable. Two, she told me to shut up. And three, like, I don't, I think there's like a, I have to have, like, there's a quota now that I know I got to say her name a certain amount of times a day. Hey. You know, so. We'll fulfill it every day. Word. That's it. But yeah, man, yo, Friday, I don't did you say you could make it or not? I do not know. All right. It's going to be in the Bronx. It's not going to be in Brooklyn. Oh, it's man. Victor's. Yo, we're trying to sponsor. I don't. I got. I spoke to Gigi. I didn't get a response yet. But I know I put in the sponsor for the ladder match. Mm -hmm. The the Climb for the Cloud ladder match. But I just haven't heard anything yet. You told me. Yeah. We been. Oh, okay. She said, yes. We did get the sponsor. She's waiting for the graphics. All right. Cool. Very nice. So yes, I'm sponsoring the ladder match. Let's start drawing up the graphics, Robert. Burn. Yo, Ray, we in there, baby. We got the ladder match. I mean, look at Yo, word, he's my inside guy. <laughs> Ray is my inside guy now. What's up, Hassan? He's the one that's telling me everything. I had one of those the first event. I was like, yo, what's the rules of this match? And he's telling us the rules. I was like, yo, what's his name? Yo, there was two guys there yesterday. I remember. Yeah, yeah. The guys sitting in front dude. of us, right? Yep. The black dude. Yep. The yep. black dude with the, his wife and his kids. Yeah. I remember. It's like, oh, no, 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 this and that. He was catching us up. Cool dude. Yeah, yeah. Um, That was a special show. That, that yeah. was my first one. Yep. I don't know if it was yours. Yeah, it was my first one, too. Oh man, and it totally knocked my whole even in the Bronx or whatever, Brooklyn, it knocked my whole thing. I don't know. I guess Bronx people are always cautious. Fuck this gonna look like. Hold on. Word. Hold on, let me check it out. If I don't like it, we bounce. <laughs> Word. So yeah, it was it was dope. It was dope. But go go ahead. No, yeah, I mean, I'm excited for that. Because, you know, we're going to have Jay Bougie and Jared Diaz on the show on Thursday. Ooh, are they fighting? They're going to be in the ladder match. They're going to be in the ladder match. They're going to be in the ladder. Let me now. Now you're going to make me look it up again because I forgot. Let me find out my boy Jay Bougie is going to come out. Victorious. Yasu. Cloud champion. Real cool dude, man. I watched the. Burn. I'm very upset I wasn't able to be on that episode, but I, I watched it. It was amazing, man. He's He was amazing to have. He was very entertaining. Word. So the match is going to have Montekia versus Montekia. Jay Bougie. Yeah. Versus Jay Bougie versus Gabriel Sky mm -hmm. versus Brandon Watts mm -hmm. versus Jack Thompson versus what? Jared Diaz mm -hmm. versus Killian McAfee. McMurphy. Mm-hmm. And they're all gonna win. They it's their money in the bank. They're all gonna win. What? They're they're all gonna win a, a shot, or they they're fighting to win a shot. What? 
Nice. The cash in the bank. Ooh, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. And that is the match we will be sponsoring. Yeah, man. Still got to get me a show. Got to oh, get me a Yeah, yeah. Fight or die. Uh, fight or die is there. Where? The guy with the S? No, nah, that's not Dominic De Niro. That's not, that's not Chris Barton. Okay, okay. They were in the match. Long hair. I think. I, I, there you go. This Ooh, is Fight or Die. Now, uh, now I remember. He got the yeah. facial hair. I love them, by the way. That's oh, yeah. Yo, team. dude. That's another team I love. Dominic De Niro was, was wrestling uh, A-game yesterday. I called him A-train, and, and uh, Ray was like, yo, it's A-game. I said, I know. That's what I said. I got a strong accent. What? But, yo, he came out with a tracksuit. My man was looking fresh. Fresh. I was like, yo. This nigga nasty with it. <laughs> it was dope, though. We gotta get we gotta get Ray and Show together once, at least one. Hey Ray, we gotta have we ever been? In, uh, have I have we ever met? I think he saw us at was it Invictus? No, he didn't go to that Invictus show. Um, not uh, he didn't go to the We Are Wrestling show. I think he saw us at one of the Battle Club pros. But we didn't introduce ourselves then. That's when we started watching the the thing. I don't think he's met you in person. That's what I was wondering, because we've been to a couple of shows. And I'm pretty sure you've probably been around most of them. We just wasn't aware of each other. So that's why I was asking. Yeah. We usually walk around, and we're usually friendly, and we speak to people. And we meet people through other people. Kofi will come around, hey, blah, blah. So there's a lot of people that we've met and shook hands with that later on we probably get to know and be like, yo, we met before. We just don't remember. Yeah. But I don't know. I'm hearing, I'm hearing, you know, chirpings that Mark Quinn is trying to convince Ray to give Mercedes Monet my number because he was like, yo, this dude's cool. He's not invited to the private party, but you can still get Mercedes, you know, we'll give Mercedes Monet's your number. Because he didn't like the fact that I was a Usos fan because I wore the We The One shirt. Yeah, he didn't like I was Usos. He's like, who's better, the Usos or the Young Bucks? I was the Usos. Come on. He didn't like that. You know you're lying. Wow, you got real serious like you was you was real. I thought I thought you would have picked the Young Bucks. No, nah, I mean, for me, they're my favorite tag team, the Usos. Like, don't get me wrong. I, the Young Bucks are phenomenal. I don't feel, I don't feel the Usos would have had the same match with uh, Ray and, and Phoenix that uh, the Young Bucks did. Because they can't do the same things that the Young Bucks would do. I agree. Like, they're not, they're not springboard 450 splash fighters, but they will have a dope match with them. Oh, of course, I'm not. I'm not denying that. You know what I, I'm saying? Like I'm biased. That's my type of wrestling. No, I I get it. But yo, think about this: the Young Bucks and the Lucha Bros are the equivalent to the Usos and the New Day. As many times as that match happens, it's always different. It's always something you got to see. It's just uh, they're on a bigger scale because the WWE's production is so is so much bigger. But I've, I've heard y'all say that before. Be like, we could watch, we hate it, but we could watch it. Everybody. Yeah, it's like, it's I don't, good. <laughs> when they say it, it's like, damn, again, but when they put it on, it's like, damn. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, Ray knows. You know, like, listen, man, just because I, Lay knows, I'm pretty sure everybody else knows, but I like people, but I, I am not illusional or delusional to the truth when it comes to other people. Me? I can do everything. I can do everything that everybody does. <laughs> Quinn was just being biased. They worked their word. But it's all right, though. Yo, he he posted me and Gigi in his story. Mark Quinn. We posted up the picture of him, and he put us in his story. I was like, yo, that's fucking dope. He's a cool dude. He's a regular dude. It's starting to make me think maybe these wrestlers are regular people, yo. Yo, see it this way, man. When we become big, we gonna be just regular guys. Are we? They are too. I'm not regular. 
you're not regular. You're probably going to have a little more money and probably going to have be a little crazier. Now nah, I can pay for it. Now nah, I can pay to break this phone. You don't want to work? <laughs> Give me another one. <laughs> Word. I got lawyers now. Word. I got lawyers now. Come here. Come here, motherfucker. How Go much how, how much would one punch cost? <laughs> Word. 50,000. <laughs> just a little doop, doop. you lucky I was good this week <laughs> it's 50,000 don't even try to take me to court <laughs> <laughs> wipe yourself off you're bleeding <laughs> that was the best 50,000 I spent I've been good hey, let's go show. <laughs> we can't be here no more <laughs> oh man yeah, they 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 normal people, man. They just yeah. they just that's their job. That's their job. Word, cause yo, cause I was screaming. I was like, yo, cause when they uh, uh they went to intermission and the first match back from intermission was there's Carter and Santi. So I'm at this point. Um, every other scream is nothing coming out of my mouth because I already lost my voice. So I'm like, match of the fucking night. And I'm trying to say it again, and it didn't happen. I just started banging on the chair in front of me. It was like, blue, blah, blue, blah, 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 blah. Match the fuck up. Yo, I was a, like an animal. And then he sits next to us. I was like, yo, this is going to be matching nights. Really? Really? You think so? I'm like, I know so. You may not know wrestling, but I know. <laughs> and then he's fucking private party. It's like, you don't know shit, private party. <laughs> you don't tell me. So how was it? It was the match of the night. <laughs> to me, even Gene oh, was saying they... match of the night. Yeah. Yo, Santi versus uh Gotch. You remember the Von Villains in WWE? They were the the circus guys, the mm -hmm. power man. The guy that, that had the mustache and he was like the power man with the singlet. He wrestled um Pena, Steve Pena for the title last night. And, yo, the crowd was quiet as shit. Pootie, what up, Pootie? Pootie in the building. That's where I was like, yo, fuck it. And I'm like, let's go, Pena. And I'm the only one saying it. And then after a while, some people will say but I was the only one saying it. And Gotch goes and sits to our right, that, that side of the ring, and he sits down on one of the, 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 the empty chairs, and he's like, Let's go, Pena. And he starts clapping. And I was like, that's not how you do it, motherfucker. This is how you do it. Let's go, Pena. Yo, and, yo, dude, I started clapping and cheering. I lost my voice again. I'm trying to scream. Nothing's coming out. I'm looking at Ray. I'm like, yo, Ray, I'm about to just start going around and tackling motherfuckers. Like, I'm, at this point, I'm taking it personal. Why is no one chanting? Like, I'm not the person. Like, oh, I want to start a chant. No, it's like, nigga. This is the main event. Y'all come here. Mute. You, you muted. Why you ain't fold the chair? Bang! <laughs> I was gonna. Clap. I was about to. Clap! <laughs> I, was, I was about to, son. Let's go and, next, baby. Let's go next. Yeah, yeah word. And, um... Oh, you good. Yeah, word, Pootie. Am I the Black Ranger? Yeah, show the Black Ranger. Hit him with the noise. What you call sucker? <laughs> Word. <laughs> but yeah, man, yo. <laughs> I was like, yo, Ray, I'm about to fuck everybody up, son. <laughs> you don't even know. Hit him with the bottom <laughs> of the chair. <laughs> yeah. He's like, yo, <laughs> let me ask all of y'all collectively a question. Have you ever met L? L. Kyle. <laughs> Bang! <laughs> Yo, he went. He went for his name, New JC. Bang! Good word. Fucking taser. Come on. I came to him and I started clapping for him. <laughs> <laughs> At one point, I was standing on the bench. I was about to be like, I got the juice now, motherfucker. <laughs> Yo, man. Yo, if I wasn't so worried about getting my white t-shirt dirty. I don't rip that shit off. I don't care how hard Gigi hit me. Damn, not for $27, my G. You good? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. 
I'm good. <laughs> Plus shipping. I just saw you invest your time. Nah, 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 nah. Think about it. <laughs> Word. This Next show. Joke... So go ahead. Uh, no, no. <laughs> Next show we're gonna break up into pairs in each section. Yo, we I get I guess we're gonna have to do that. Like I'm just gonna be like, fuck it. I'm gonna do a lap and just run around. Let's go back and just start running around the fucking ring. Let's go back. <laughs> It's crazy because I, I enjoy sitting around all of y'all. But I also enjoyed when we were separated the first time. Because when Darius Carter came out, Kofi was on the other side of the ring. And he was cheering, yeah, Darius Carter, we love you. And Kenny was here next to me. Shut up, boo! <laughs> and it was going back and forth. Yeah. So we had the crowd on each side going crazy. But I do like it better when we amongst each other. So it's like I wish yeah. we could have both where we're like, yo, go, but I do it. I, it sucks because we want to be around each other. No word. But it, it was dope. Go ahead, my yeah. I was yo, we was th- we was throwing streamers at everybody yesterday. Who? But Gigi bought mad streamers. Oh. So we threw streamers at Matt. I think we threw streamers at uh, Jody when she won. Nice. We had, we threw, I know somebody threw streamers at uh, Scott Ricans when they won. Nice. It was just like, <laughs> but Gigi still got streamers left over. So Gigi's sponsorship won. Yeah. Well, she, she, she sponsored the whole match. So uh, Scott Ricans and Prolific. Nice. Yo, Queen kept throwing the, the streamers too. He just kept throwing it. He's like, "What is good to poof?" It don't matter who was in the ring. Poof. <laughs> yeah, man, it was dope. How was your weekend show? So far, so good. It's, it's it started off well. A little, I was gonna say rested, but at the same time, I was with the kids today, so it wasn't as. Rested as usual, which was dope. Though it, I, I got to spend time with my kids. It was, uh, it was nice. I enjoyed it. So so far so good. One day, and it's getting better. Got to spend time with you guys, which is always awesome. And you guys invest your time in me, so I appreciate that. Like I said, you you guys are here. Y'all could have been anywhere, and it's gonna get better because tonight we have. An awesome fight, which I am about to start logging on to. Word. Where is the... I think, hold on, I think I... Yeah, well, I was going to say, don't fight, don't, don't fuck it up. You know I gave you the secrets. Yo, that fucking fight is 90 bucks, bro. Where? If you were to pay for it, like a fucking... Like, uh, and there, oh, fuck you, Mama Webber. Oh, shit, there's UFC too. There's uh, Pablo against uh, Blades. Blades, yeah, double. They normally do that. I think UFC tries to fuck with the uh, their boxing shit. Well, they did terrible because I don't want, I don't want to watch no damn Blade. Word, I mean, Blades is good, but he's not stopping me from watching. <laughs> yeah. I that would be you would you would need John Jones or the return of John Jones would have been oh shit he won already he's sitting in the ring <laughs> nah you wish with the with the flag oof, oof, oof. I got a commercial right now. Showtime is streaming with Paramount Plus. Oh, you got Paramount Plus? I got no. oh, you me too. Yeah, I got the Paramount Plus free. <laughs> Very nice. Oh shit! Who's this guy? This new UFC champion, looking like a little roach. 
My man got dreadlocks. He's he's like Demetrius Jansen size. Well, I don't know. I'm seeing a commercial. I don't know what you're looking at. No, I'm, I'm describing you the rest uh, the the fighter. See if you know him. What UFC? Yeah, UFC. Short dread. Oh, I see his name. Stotts. Oh, this is we missed a fight with the dude from fucking Creed One. Oh, the Mexican? Yeah. That's why I said it was, he won already because he got the Mexican flag. Yeah, he, he looked like he won. The dude from Creed 3 lost, so. Oh, okay. I was going to say the Mexican looked like he won. He looked happy as fuck. He's, he's the first guy that um, uh, Creed fought before that championship match. He should have fought him a couple more times. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! You fell? You alright, my dude? Yeah, I've dropped some shit behind this. Ah oh, shit! Toe like fell you. backwards. Ew. My neck and my back. Try to move one napkin, and all the markers on the move. The whole fucking walking down. <laughs> That's toe's luck. You move one screw. <laughs> Even the TV fell. Oh man. Oh, this is nice. Save that. Let's see how that looks. Yo, I gotta put up my poster. I got fucking two posters I gotta put up. One from yeah. We Are Wrestling, the other one from uh Invictus Wrestling. Yeah. Right Did you get one yesterday? Nah, we didn't get one. Okay, okay. That's fine. Not bad. Um, let me see. I'm trying to look at the chat because I, I know I asked everybody a question, but I can't see if you answered. There you go. All right. So, yeah, when y'all get a chance, I want to know. Y'all into sports, boxing, UFC. Tonight they're giving both. But I am not tuning into UFC right now because I am very interested in this Tank Davis versus Ryan Diaz. Ryan, oh, I said Ryan Diaz. <laughs> We got a new diamond wrestler for well, boxing. We even got boxes, y'all. But anyways, we do uh Ryan Garcia. I am interested in this fight because I I've always been a Ryan Garcia fan. And I've always been a Tank Davis fight fan. So it's like when both of the people that you like go together, it's scary. It's scary, but it's a fun thing to watch because even if the other one loses. Matter of fact, I think I'm going to feel both emotions. I'm going to be upset and happy. Yeah. Oh, shit. No. Why? It's, it's going to be. It's going to be fun. Yeah. Yeah, Ray. This is this, going to be a, hopefully a good one. It might. I don't want no Mike Tyson. Round one. Bing. Oh, he left hook. Down he goes. Over. And it's dead. And it's dead. It's crazy. So yeah, it's a, it's gonna be a little, well. I don't even know who Blades is fighting though. In UFC, I don't know who his name is. Well, I saw his name as I read it, but I got I guess like I like Toe said, we're not good with names, so I gotta see his face, and then I probably know who is who he is. Like I've seen him fight before, but I don't think it interests me as much as this boxing match though. I've been waiting for this one. I've been waiting for this one like I was waiting for John Jones. Matter of fact, I've been waiting for this one like I was waiting for Israel Zanya to for the knockdown. Like I hope it's a good one. I hope it's some Felix Trinidad versus De La Hoya back and forth match where they they go at it. And they were talking a lot of every every like press conference I see, they are going at it. They are going crazy. They are arguing. They are fighting. Oh snap! Right now they presenting the 
the entrance. Well, they doing the little recap, but they show you how to be started, I guess. Hopefully, Toe was able to log into, well, watch the match. Yeah, I'm able to watch it. All right. I, I didn't know if he was. My bad. Like I told you, she move operator. We in there. I'm happy. Word. It's just, I keep getting this damn pop-up. You better get a pop-up blocker. You know what's crazy? I don't even know if it's going to be a slugfest. If, it was, if I was Ryan Garcia, I would do some speed in and out. Like, I would give him a lesson. I'm, blah, blah, hit him one, two. Hit him a thousand times. Blah, 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 and then move out the way. Woo, woo. I'm out. And I would do 150 times. Blah, 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 blah. Because Ryan Garcia is a lot faster than Tank. Yo, how I got a Twitch chat on this shit? On what? <laughs> on that stream. Nice. I can't even see the Twitch chat. I put it in theater mode because I got it half and half. I got this. I got the. I'm over here pointing this shit. I forgot I had the camera off. I got this side the stream, this side the stream. I ain't gonna lie, right? Right, gonna see a little skinny ass fuck. Word. Who you going for, Tope? I mean, I I haven't really never seen uh, Garcia fight before, so I I think Davis got this shit. Oh, you could watch in the um, previews. He's been dropped once. And in that fight, he got back up and won. He dropped him, which is the one they presented. Now I, I don't know if you watched. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm seeing that. That was the first time he ever was dropped. That was for the title. Uh, he destroyed the guy that everybody thought was gonna beat him. Some Mexican dude. He hit him with a phantom punch. I think I don't know who was it that was showing it to us. Oh, that said it. It was like, yo, he hit him with a punch that nobody saw to the replay. Yeah, I heard that that shit. Yeah, that's how fast it was. My man clipped him with a she. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Cause but, he I jumped mean, out of nowhere. What happened? Yeah, I mean, like <laughs> I've I've punched faster than that. You know what I'm saying? I know faster than the speed of light. Burn. I'm trying to see if they show that punch. Because it was like a little check hook. And he caught him real quick. Ooh, Javante is in the building. Okay. Got his little dreadlocks. All right, so you got Davis. Guys, who y'all got out there in the in the chat? Out there in the... In TV land. Out there in TV land, the millions and millions of dollars that are in there. Who do you have? Tank say he is going to knock out Ryan Garcia. Yo, this shit isn't as smooth as nah. It, it's uh, I'm not gonna lie. When it's like a big event and everybody, everybody's doing it. Because we ain't the only ones. We should be. It's going to be, hopefully it's not like that throughout the fight. Yeah. But it's going to be like in those videos. <laughs> Where they make those. Oh, snap. Oh, what a put. And then you hear the voice, but it doesn't. What happened? By the time they come back, the guy's on the floor. Oh, no. Knock them out. Look, yeah, my, my shit is stuck. And on the tail of the tape. <laughs> the tail of the bet. You got to hit play again. I just refresh it. Yeah, I got to do the same. Let me nope. Know. She's still there. Uh-oh. For the server one. 
My man said, time for emergency. My man went, <laughs> let's go to Japan. 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 My shit went back to server two. What the fuck? I, went, I pressed server oh, one. Shit. You can't even switch servers. Ah, oh, shit. Hey, well, now, now I'm on server one. Now it's back. I don't know. Tell nobody where you are, what server you on. There's a lot of people out there. They're listening, they're going to take our server. But yeah, man. <clears throat> yeah, so show, man. I be walking now. My le- my ankle be fucking hurting the motherfucker. My, <laughs> my my fingers be hurting. I'm getting old, man. How you know how I feel? I've been telling you that for like the last year, I think. And it's sad that we feel like that because we're not even 40. But I think it's because we, we work a lot. Like, if we're not normal, we, we take impounding. We, while you take 100 steps a day, we take 10,000 to 20. Word. So, basically, I walk as much as you walk in a month, in one day. <laughs> Word. So, my, my foot, right now, my foot, I wasn't even doing the hard job my foot. I'm scared. I have this bruise on my foot. You got and a got bruise it, on your foot? Yeah, I got it yesterday. I don't know how. The bottom yeah. of my foot. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know if one of my <laughs> shoes had a rock in it. I have a very painful bruise, and I'm scared. I'm like, I hope this shit is gone by Monday, because I got to do my regular hard job. <laughs> Damn. Oh, bro, I need my foot. Yo, yeah, that's what I'm Mama. thinking about on the weekend. <laughs> oh, my God. Mama, I need a new foot. Oh, here we go. Okay, Morello Jr. versus Facio. Okay, that's all we needed to do. Go to Channel 1. Shit, I, I took a uh, handful of chips and my brother's like, yo, take them all. I was like, nah, nah. I'm, I just need a little bit. Now I'm like, damn, I'm about to go get me some. <laughs> I'm about to go get me that bag of chips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, I like, got him. Yo, the sneakers I got, the 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 ones I showed you before, they were like seventy five. They good, you know. They're comfortable and shit. It's just you know when you walk too much with them, it's like your it's comfortable to step on, but your feet still swell up. Mm-hmm. I think you know what I'm saying? Gonna, I think it's gonna be every sneaker, bro. I yeah. gave up. I gave up. I don't even know what shoe I was wearing yesterday. I'm pretty sure it's one of the ones that I've been wearing that I thought was comfortable. Yeah, but I gave up. I'm like. We just gonna hurt, like I told you, because of that simple fact. We walk as much as you walk in a month, and it fuck in a fucking day. Word. Yo, I'm. Uh, oh, they're sold out, so I can't even tell you. Who sold out? And they got the Jordan Jumpman twos, but they're white and black. It was the all black ones. I was like, yo, I'm about to cop them, but they're sold out. Yo, this shit just what this shit just did an announcement three times on the show. The super middleweight, bing, bing, bing. The super middleweight, bing, bing, bing. The super hey, middleweight. As long as it's doing something, <laughs> <laughs> keep moving, B. As long as it's moving, it hasn't stopped. That's what had me worry at first. Wait a minute, it's gonna be like this. Oh no! But I, right now it's crystal clear. The guy's coming out. Yo, they got a weather ri- Oh, never mind. They got a weatherizer? I was like, they got a weatherized version of the sneaker I got. So it's waterproof, and then it's like, nope. It's <laughs> item no longer available. Is that a word? A weatherized sneaker? <laughs> yeah, so it's they, they do it so it's waterproof. Oh, what's up? You know? <laughs> I know you meant this, I'm saying waterproof and weatherized is what I'm trying to figure out. <laughs> 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 Is it a suitable replacement? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, men men's weatherized roadrunner shoes. I like it. That's crazy. I never knew. I thought you that's the word <laughs> that you just on the fly, weatherized. I think I weatherized I'm gonna weatherize my car. <laughs> I put in the silicone on it. 
I like that word. Uh, That's yo. crazy. I thought you was making that word up. Nah, what up, Kofi? We live, baby. We live. Kofi. I lost, I lost my voice, Kofi, so don't expect me to scream out here. Nope. Yo, the, the Nike Air Max with that big-ass bubble on it, the 270s? Mm-hmm. They fucking sold out. It, it was blue and orange, $97. Sold out. It's always the good ones. Yeah. Yo, I was uh, trying to make it. Well, you you was there, right? On Raw. He was talking about going to the uh, outlets. Yeah. I want, wanted to go with y'all. We got to make. We got to set a date. If y'all make a trip, y'all come out here, like I said. Y'all could do both. Y'all always invited. Word. Let me see. I'm trying out some backgrounds. Don't mind me. No quiero cara, pero no hueve. Yo, my man is fighting Yamaguchi Mama Quavo. <laughs> he muted, yo. <laughs> I heard his name and then you came out of the way, Yamaguchi Mama Huevo. <laughs> I was like, well, what? Oh, shit, my man came in dope, though. He's like, whoop, we over here? What's up? He is the man. champ. I knew it. Just by the way he came in the ring, whoop, I can tell. Word. This guy winning. Hey, put my money on him. This on the walk-in. <laughs> he got style in the walk-in. He going to win the match. Am I the only one that does that? Not even the walk-in. Sometimes it's just... The look. The look. Matter of fact, from the... From the... From the... How you call this? Presentation. And then just yeah. corner. I'm like, uh-oh. This dude don't even look like he... Just from him bouncing. Oh, no. That that you don't belong. Bouncing right. You don't belong here. You don't got a hitch to it. You know, you got to bounce with it, man. Yeah. He doing it wrong. Nah, 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 nah. nah. Yo, let me go get that bag of chips, though. Nah, but I feel you, though. Because you can see, he's like, yo, my man look like he's scared. <laughs> my man said, I'm hungry. Shut the cameras. <laughs> I'm going to go get those chips. My man gave up real quick. He thought about it. He's been, he been sitting here working, doing the job. Thinking about them chips that he only took a handful of. He's like, when should I? When is the right time for me to cut this camera off and say, fuck this, I'm getting my chips right now? I'm out. But man, he makes me hungry. You see, ladies and gentlemen, he's always fucking everything up. Kofi, take him. Take him with you. Always making me hungry. Making me want to use the bathroom. Making me pee on myself. Wait a minute. Whoa. Follow that. I apologize. <laughs> I sound like R. Kelly. I peed on myself. Oh, man. But here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what title this is for. I don't know who's fighting because I've never seen this guy. And this guy has a title. And he's 8 and 0. Oh. He's had eight matches. He already the champion. Super champion. I whooped the champion's ass <laughs> on my seventh match. <laughs> <laughs> my man said, I don't need no other fights. I want you. All right, I'll take him. He only got seven matches, and I whooped his ass. <laughs> nah, and he I'm wants to fight Carnelo? You fucking. <laughs> <him. laughs> That's what everybody thought. He want to fight Carnelo. Yep. And he won. He's 9 0. Undisputed champion, baby. Oh, this guy got 25, 26 matches. He's 24 and 1. Look at oh, the this. Oh, this is Yamaguchi right. Mama Huevo, right? Yeah, Yamaguchi Mama Huevo. He looked like a creative character in the boxing game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. When he got the good hair, but he's black, you change his hair from the Afro Poo <laughs> Poo. <laughs> 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 My man looking like Elvis, but he's he's fucking pitch black. 
Damn, I'm racist, man. Oh, my bad. But it does look like that. When you you put the wrong hair on him, put the afro. Look, undisputed champion. Eight and oh. He's four and oh in title fight. So my man won this shit when he won in his fifth match. Smart. Fifth match, yo. The ch- he did the fucking Rocky Balboa. Yeah, we gonna give him a we gonna give him a chance because of his name. David Morales Jr. Oh, that's a beautiful name. Give him a chance. And he whooped the champion's ass. Word. <laughs> I've been ever since. Yo, unless my man got 4,000 fucking amateur fights. Hey, what the fuck? My man, I'm the champ. I've been like that for four matches. I don't even know how to box, B. I just came in and whooped his ass. <laughs> <laughs> Word. That's how I fight. <laughs> I ain't even have a corner man that, that fucking match. This guy just signed me afterwards. <laughs> I don't even know him. Look, he don't even want to look at him. He's a chunk. My man's like, yo, I don't know what the fuck. Why are they doing all this shit in the street? We just fight. <laughs> so, <laughs> where's my camera? Well, yo, fam. You see my record? I won the title when I was 4-0. <laughs> you know how dangerous I am? You don't even deserve my look. My How man, funny I'm, would it be? First punch, my man knocks up Morales. Word, my man come out there like Rocky Balboa, like fucking Ivan Draga, one handed. <laughs> Bow, <laughs> got him. Take your ain't no ass out of here. Word. <laughs> <laughs> and the new champ, Mario Mamachucci. <laughs> 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 that was easy. That was easy. My bad. Damn. I told you it was a fluke. Oh, oh, oh. Yo, Wait damn, a minute. He, he, he rocking with that left. Word, the champ looking nice. Wait a minute. This ain't no fluke. My mama fought, taught me how to fight. Ooh. Nah, the champ look nice. Yeah, he's man, dodging. You saw that? Yep. Matrix. Yeah. He's digging the body shots in that motherfucker. And he got, and he got style. You can see by the way he's moving. He got, ooh, oh. Now the champ is for real. Hold on. Yo, that one two is deadly. Word, you saw that over the. Yo, that uppercut rocked him. Uh oh. The champ so far. Let me start talking because I'm going to be saying all this. The champ looking nice. Blow. Down goes the champion. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. My man, Weeby Wobby. Word. Y'all, my Gucci don't know where he at. You saw him walking to the wrong corner? Where am I? My man said, you ain't going to stop the fight, Rip? Wait a minute. What? Is this UFC? <laughs> Can I kick? Wrong sport. That's on the other arena. Thing. I thought you said he only got eight matches. What? Oh, shit, the my champ. Man, the dude, yo, Mama Wewe was only 24 and 1. You see Mama Wewe holding on? Hey, Damn. please. I'm sorry. My man said your 23 other fights. It wasn't real fights. Oh, my, no, my. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, now goes the Mama Yuchi. It's over. <laughs> Word. Oh, shit, the yo, champ my is man, for real. My, my <laughs> man hit him with that. Oh, my, that's a get <laughs> Yo, the champ is the real deal. I'm Yo, the one <laughs> word, the <laughs> one two. And my man said, "Toma and Coco Tasso." They got the doctors in there. He got a mask. He dead. The champ killed him. Word. I told you, nine and oh, baby, the street crazy. <laughs> and he wants, he wants um, <laughs> Carnelo. You. Let's see what happens. Nah, he look nice though. I ain't gonna lie. The manager knew exactly what he was doing. You want to fight this little kid? He he, 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 she, he only got five matches. <laughs> I <laughs> got him. My man came out there with him. One, two, blah, blah. Look, he's dead. Yo, for real. They they really put in the neck brace on him. <laughs> <laughs> My man hit him with the... <laughs> Yo, 
I have a dragon with him. If he dies, he dies. He, dies. <laughs> that, he didn't want to look at him. He's like, I'm going to kill this nigga later. Wait a minute. Yo, this nigga looks like a cheater, bro. I am <laughs> I'm 12. I am 12 ass me. He's using somebody else's paper. This man was fighting in Puerto Rico for 30 years. My man got the baby face. They brought him to America as Juan Vito. That's that motherfucker. Crazy. That's that motherfucker that's zero zero in the park, but he's 106. His, his rank Ooh, is 106. Word. <laughs> My man, you've been practicing. <laughs> Yo, I've had a hundred professional fights in Puerto Rico. Don't tell nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he destroyed him. <laughs> destroyed. My man was dodging punches like the Matrix. He saw everything. He was hitting him with this one-two over the top. Shut up. Yeah, I'm waiting for him to fight somebody that's going to throw a punch back. I don't think that dude threw one punch back. Nah, he threw a punch because he dodged some shit. I was like, that's when I knew he was real. Like the first couple of seconds, my man did some shit. I was like, "Uh (laughs) uh-oh. Once I saw that, I was like, he knows how to move. Word. I was like, this is the trick. <laughs> Mama Way will look at his coins. I can't hit him. He's too fast. Let's treat him. Hey, Ivan Drago, his ass. It's just an exhibition. <laughs> it's for eight to one in the middle. He ain't get to talk to the coach. He ain't get no coaching. He ain't made it to the corner. Word. He did. Wait a minute. Let me see. Did he get up? Nah, he really did. Look, he really... The other guy's trying to check on him. My man said... Why ain't y'all tell him I'm really 60-something years old? Word. He cheating, B. I'm 12 ass. I, I am 12. <laughs> you can say, yo, he's, he's Danny Magnante or whatever the fuck that, that baseball player. I'm 19. I'm 20. Yo, no, what was he? He's 14. He's a fucking 19 year old player. Word. No hitter in the fucking little kid classic. Oh, Yo, my. Diablo. My man hit him with the George Foreman right hook. Oh, boom. He bounced off of the fucking rope. The ref stopped the fight while he was standing, so I don't know how he ended up on the floor dead. <laughs> Here it is. Oh, no, this is the finish. Oh, he hit him with another George Foreman to the jaw. No, oh, he hit him with that thumb breaker. Hit him with the... Uh, what's, what's the El Cablan? I don't remember. El Cablan. Uh-oh, they're going to give a close-up. Watch this. The kid look like he running away. His head is down. Where am I? It's my turn. You fighting the champ, sucker. Oh, no. Finish him. Look at the tattoo on his waist. It just went up to his back. (laughs) (laughs) Yo, his blood is rushing to his head so fast his skin is changing color. I told you, his hair went from fucking good to afro. I told you they had the wrong character in there. <laughs> oh, shit. He did. Look at the ref. He, he, didn't, have the a, he didn't have a match that he won by knockout? Not no more. Not all his right. Uh, he only, he, it said it was seven fights by knockout. Oh, okay. So all of them except for one. Maybe the champ. That's crazy. Can't read a book by his cover. You saw me, man. This little kid, eight and oh, man. They just put a title on his shoulder. No, they did it. <laughs> I whipped the champ's ass. I'm smart. I didn't become professional till I was ready. I whipped everybody in the hood's ass. Now I want the champ. And he look young. He look like he in his 20s, 21. Word. He look super young. 
up and coming prospect, y'all. Oh man, the guys walking, they walking them out like a little kid holding his hands. Man. Oh me. Look both ways before you cross the street. <laughs> oh me, oh me. Yeah. My man walking, yo, that's how we walk my grandma, my grandma honey. He got a person on each hand. Hold my hands. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we laughing. My fault. I hope I hope he's doing all right. I'm just I'm doing the show. I'm trying to be funny. I hope everything's cool with him though. We should have known to by the jacket. That that's a dope jacket. Mm-hmm. You thought I wore this shit to lose? You straight bugging. My man is on some. Give me Conor McGregor. Anybody. I am ready. I am 12 and I've been champion 1,000 times. Como se llama Jake Paul? You want to fight me? Okay. You want to fight me, Jake Paul? No, como te llama? Yes, okay. I want my Tyson right now. Oh. <laughs> okay. They say, they say, fight my him. It's him if I'm on my way, okay, no problem. Now I want Canelo Abras and Jake Paul together. Okay, no, okay, okay, no problem. I not go for them out together. <laughs> together, they, want. they go there, eat together, they be together. No, I say, okay, okay, no, no, no problem. No, no, not a problem. No, not a problem. Right, matter of fact, right now, <laughs> hold my title. <laughs> yeah, thank you, man. I'm so sorry that it's okay. No, me, give me, no, me gusto. It's so, so sorry. Let me hear you sound like that. <laughs> I'm so excited. The crazy thing is we've been imitating him before he started talking. Man, we raised it. But we got it right, so that's exactly how he sounded. It's but, another the 10 8 round, 14 round, you got 77, 77 round, knock us so excited. De porta, ¿cómo te llama? ¿Qué te llama? ¿Qué te llama? ¿Qué te llama? ¿Qué te llama? ¿Cómo te llama? ¿Cómo te llama? ¿Cómo te llama? Jake Paul, ¿Cómo te llama? 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 ¿Cómo it's it's okay. It's okay. He's still alive. It's okay. Knockout. Uh, knockout. One, two. No Apaca. problem. Apaca right hook. And no problem. You want I me wish. to fight? I fight main event tonight. No problem. I take both of them and knock out 10 round. It's okay. You know what, De La Hoya? This is too easy. I fight I fight you right now. Get in the ring. <laughs> right now. <laughs> this is too easy. I want another match right now. <laughs> Yo, he whooped his ass. Bow, damn. And he saw that coming because you saw him flinch. Hey. My man did the all oh, shit. This is why he's champion. I think people go training like that. You only got eight fights, man. I'm gonna whoop. I'm gonna be the new champion. And then he hits him with that, and my boy, my my huevo don't even know his name. Where am I? Yeah, my man said, "Oh no, it's no problem. It's no problem. No mama Gucci. You wanna come out and knock him out again? No problem. He walk out and knock him out again. No problem." Hey, who am I? Hey, what's my name? <laughs> In the interview, uh, Mister Yamaguchi. Oh, who am I? <laughs> hey, Mister Yamaguchi. That uh, me. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> My man said, I want to fight Benavides again. No problem. No problem. I want to fight Benavides. You got me. Get in the ring right now. Before. I don't give a fuck about your way. What the fuck? Man? What you call me? I call me out. And I'm doing every single. Tell him motherfucking English. I want to fight Benavides one more time. That's we what never he fought said? before, but I want to fight him one more time. That's what he said? Yeah, he just called out Benavides. That's crazy. You know who Benavides is? That's the one we just saw. That would be a great match. Yeah. That's he just called him out. Call... Fight, uh, who he fought? He fought, he fought Stan. a champion. Uh, say, yeah, not Stan. I know you're talking Juan about Carlos Stan, yeah, from the Yankees. 
What? <laughs> you Juan Carlos? <laughs> what? Exactly what? Exactly. <laughs> 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 you you just made my you made my brain do that. I'm like, yeah, yeah. What's his name? And then you what said, you that was what? Nah, what? It's the queen. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? Wait a minute. <laughs> Who the fuck yeah, no problem. Juan Carlos está en We get your orange judge. No problem. Es que tú me dices que no me lo consigo. No me lo consigo. Ya, all of them. No me lo consigo. No me lo consigo. No round, man. I mean, no problem. He fought Caleb Plant. Uh, <laughs> like, I think it was a month ago. It was a great match. We, matter of fact, we watched it on stream as well. That Word. was the first time we watched. That I told you. He wanted to fight Canelo. And I said, oh, he's good. He's like a bruiser. That was a good match. That was a good start to this, ladies and gentlemen. Where? But. Bendy single, Bendy single, Bendy single. Bendy single, Bendy single, Bendy single. The champion came out there and represented. I whooped his ass. Yo no sé mañana que no me so yo digo lo paga de que lo guago. That's what he said. <laughs> that's what he said. That's what, that's what. Fucking mendejo um, heard. <laughs> when he woke up and walla was walla's law with a wallo you live in. I'm okay. I'm okay. I woke up myself. You're on your back. Okay, okay. I woke up. My man walked out like this with two chaperones. <laughs> My man was on the floor longer than he was in the fight. <laughs> walked out like weekend at Bernie's. Oh, the the fight is next. Already? Yeah. The, what you think? They fucking uh, around? They don't play. One match and that's it? Fuck it. We fighting. Nah, we can't yeah. contain this. We can't contain this no more. They fighting in the back. Word. <laughs> we had other matches, but fuck it. <laughs> I need some ice cream. <laughs> to go with my chips. <laughs> Dipping my chips in there. That's good. Nah, I hope this. Well, if it is, I'm. It's not like I paid that much. It was. It was. <laughs> I got the match for a good, good price. So I can't complain if it's only two matches. And we can always go to UFC. I'm pretty sure UFC is gonna have about fifteen. Where they at? Las Vegas? Did they do the MGM? Oh uh, yeah, they're in Las Vegas. Okay, I, I know this because he just said, "What an atmosphere here in Las Vegas." I see. I didn't hear what he's saying because I got my headphones, but they were oh. showing an aerial view of it. So I'm like, "Where are we, Las Vegas?" Yo, um, yeah, there was four matches on the card. Ooh, so we missed it. Oh, well, we came in on the third one. I mean, what we paid, you know? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, <laughs> I was in the fight. kitchen. He was like, oh, well, you know, for what I paid for it, it's yeah. just all right. I started right. laughing. Right. Yeah, shit. Ice all over the fucking place. What the fuck? Who sat on it? It was freezer burn, but I don't give a fuck. Those are the best. They got icicles outside the icicles. <laughs> I got ice cream outside the ice cream. I know this shit ain't gonna melt. Nope. That shit is gonna go into your stomach, guys. Eyes. <laughs> Yo, is it raining by you? It was. It usually rains here first. So if you're raining, uh, Yo, gonna... when I got the chips, my brother, you hear that? I took my headphones off. I was like, damn. Thunderstorm. Or the thunderclap. It started like a. Five. I went outside. My sunroof was up. I'm like, let me put my sunroof now, which didn't want to close. Then it finally did. Then my car is misfiring, so I gotta fix that tomorrow. I gotta figure out what's going on with it. Word. Check your spark plugs. Yeah, yeah. I already. Nowadays, man, it's crazy. I would have texted you if we didn't have YouTube. I bought, I don't know if you remember, back in the days, I told you, yo, should I buy this? Uh, it was a ODB scanner. They were, they had, a matter of fact, it was Black Friday. They had it on sale for $20. 
And it, I'm like, man, it's twenty dollars. It's a little machine. And everybody gave it mad bad reviews because it has an app that you have to pay for, so that it'll tell you like, wait, what is this? It's a little ODB reader for your car. It tells you what's oh, wrong. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So it comes with an app that if you want to use the app to the ODB, like it tells you the code, it tells you the problem, it tells you how to fix it. Like the extra stuff to tell you how to fix it, to tell you what mechanic to go to, at what price, all that extra stuff. You could pay a annual, like a fee. So people were upset, like, yo, they just trying to get your monthly or your your fee. Like, they trying to get you to pay money, aside from the $20 for ODB reader. So I kept reading into it, reading. <coughs> Excuse me. I kept reading it. And I saw some of the comments are like, nah, uh, these people are dumb. You could just hit, like, at the, when you download the app, it tells you the prices. In the little corner, there's an X. You can just press it, and you can use the app. You just don't get the features. So I'm like, okay, I'm just going to buy it. It's $20. I'm going to try it. Hopefully, it's not one of those cams where you got to buy the app to use it. If it is, it's $20. I bought yeah. it, and it's exactly the, like what they said. It was like, yo, if you click the X, you can use it. It'll tell you what's wrong with the car. It'll scan it for you. It'll do everything the old DB scanner will do. It just you can't use the features like the mechanic and what shop to go to. I don't need that shit. I could go to any mechanic I want. Yeah. So I, so I used that and it worked perfectly. It told me immediately once my check engine started flashing, it told me my fucking one of my cylinders is mis- misfiring. Cylinder three. So I gotta I'm gonna change the right. cylinder from one to okay. the other. Go ahead, I'm listening. So you got an inline four or six on the six. So it the way it goes, it's usually the the cylinder furthest from the transmission is cylinder one. So if you had a four, right? And then you have the transmission on the left side, the, the engine on the right side, the one that's on the right side, that's one. So that first two I don't know how your shit works, but it should be like the furthest ones from the transmission is like one. I'll send, one. You a, I'll send you a picture so you can see how it looks. I'm going to work on it tomorrow. I don't know if I should. It might not be the spark plug. I got to check. I got to well, see if it's the plug. Did, it oh. said it's misfiring. Did it say running lean or a rich or anything like that? Nah, it just the letter wasn't. I heard if the letter was A, it would be critical or something like that, but it was P. So I don't know if that makes a difference. I don't know what that means, but like the code like, is, it, it was P three hundred three. When I looked it up, it said if the code started with an A, like A three hundred three, it would be a major code, like a major misfire. This one is not. So I'm, I was saying that because I didn't know if that would help with what you was trying to figure out. If it was running lean or I don't know if that helped. I, I'm pretty sure it didn't. <laughs> what? It helped because it's P O three O three. Yeah. The third Cause, cylinder, yeah. Cause I just looked it up, it said stop driving immediately, repair urgency, fix this code immediately to avoid ignition failure and crat- uh, catalytic converter damage. That's right. Yeah. But there's a video here of how to fix it. Let's see. It says in three minutes. Let's see this bullshit. Remove the ignition coil. Yeah, that's the... Check the ignition coil. Clean or replace the ignition coil. Yeah. That's what I was telling you. I got to... Well, I got to see if that's it because I'm going to... I got to put the three ignition coil somewhere else. And then if the misfire switches to that coil, then it's the coil. And not the spark plug. Now, I don't know if... You know what? I think I'm going to just change everything. I'm going to change the actual... Because I don't want this to happen again. And I want to... I don't want my engine to start. Like, I don't want my engine to go. So I'm going to try... I think I'm going to change all the spark plugs. 
and I'm gonna change the the coil. It's, uh, okay, so here you go. It says common causes include ignition system troubles, fuel delivery issues, or leak leaking valves. However, a faulty or worn out spark plug or ignition plug coil pack is the most common cause of the misfire. This is especially true if your car tune up has been delayed for a while. So yeah, start with the check your 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 uh, spark plug, the the tip. If it's corroded, smell it. If it smells like gas or anything like that, then maybe it's not firing. But you know, if it looks good, then it might be the coil. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, how no. many miles are on your car? One fifty now. And when was the last time you changed the spark plugs? Never. I just got. I just got it. What did he? He didn't tell you when was the last time he changed his purpose, right? Nah, that, you know how. Well, yeah. So, yeah. So, change the spark plugs, change the coils, change the oil. You yeah, know, do that again. You know, um, I gotta change the oil in my shit too. The app just gave me a a notification. It gives me a notification when to change my oil. And the tire, like if you input you. Damn, you just reminded me. If you put your tires, they'll tell you when to rotate it. Cool. Okay. Right. Is it, the free the free part of it is pretty good. Some people are just not very, not fond of using internet, I guess. I'm not going to lie. I have seen that in other apps where it gives you the prices. $99.99. You're like, shit, I got to pay. You immediately delete it. Yeah. And then you, all you had to do was press the X, and it'll let. It's twelve ninety nine to use the subscription part of it, but yeah. you can use it for free. Just the good stuff that you're gonna need is gonna be in the subscription. You already know it. But the app, is, uh, another thing the app does, it gives you an estimated cost, which is pretty accurate. It tells you how much the parts would cost, how long it would take a mechanic to do it. Yeah, because they, they usually char charge by work time. Mm-hmm. Which sucks, because that happened to me once. I had a Mercedes. I, that's why you, you, if, you, if you have those cars, you got to be able to afford it. I went to change my batteries. I had a... The Mercedes had two batteries. They had one for the accessories and the big one for the car. I wanted to change the little accessory one. And the matter yeah. of fact, since we here, let's do both of them. The guy said, I right, uh, it's going to be, I think he charged 106 an hour of labor. I said, cool, how much is it going to be? He said, the two batteries is $100 each. That's 200 And then I'm going to charge you, it says, the computer says two hours of labor. I said, you got to be shitting me, fam. He said, I said, yo, I looked at him. I said, I understand it's a computer. You telling me you're going to take two hours to put in two batteries when it takes me 15 minutes to unplug one without the tools? Word. Like, you, you shitting me. You telling me you're literally going to sit there for two hours with my battery. He said, all right, I only charge you once. I said, just give me the batteries. I'll, I'll take them home. I'll unplug them myself. Yeah, that's fucking ridiculous. Yeah. That was the last time I went there. I mean, he's a good mechanic. He's just expensive. Yeah, most mechanics are, man. That's why. I, that's why I try to do shit myself. I the gas, the the oil changes. I do. I, I'll go to the fucking car wash. At least I get a car wash out of it. Oil changes is I have a house. I bought some ramps. It was so, the last time was so gratifying. Gratis. Is it graf, gratifying? Gratifying, yeah. Yeah, I said it right. Damn. Yeah, you did. I use that more. Yeah, so it felt good. I did it myself. I bought the cash can. Put on the, I did everything myself. I cleaned it. When you do it for yourself and for your car, you do it with love and care. You clean the oils. You put the little oil on the ring. You make sure there's no dirt going in. I don't know. I guess it felt good. 
doing it right. So I, I that I think I'm gonna do more of it. No, I hear you. It's just I when in my other house where we first lived, that I worked on my car outside. I didn't give a shit. It's because you know I can make noise. People knew me there. Here. I work on my car, people come out, look at what you're doing. And, uh, you know, people are like, yo, they, they act like I don't know what I'm doing here. When I'm I change, nervous. when I change Krill's girls' breaks, she was like, yo, if you need any tools, let me know, man. I was like, I'm good. I got all the tools I need. I got more tools than I need for this. Don't worry about it. I, I know everything. If you need anything, let me know. Yeah, but it's just like, I have to find a spot in front of my house. I, there was one time I I changed my car, my my oil in the corner. It was another block. I just fucking put the ramps up, <laughs> did that shit. People were like, what the fuck is this nigga doing? I was like, I need the car changed oil. Like fuck it. I said, you know what? Fuck it. I'll pay to get that shit changed. Stealing my own catalytic. Shut up. Yeah. Well, it sucks. Can't even. I remember when people would just mind your business. You know how many people I've seen on the cars. Actually working on them, tire off. I'm, last thing I'm thinking is what they doing. Yeah, minding my own fucking business. That's what I'm doing. Word. It ain't my car. Word. Matter of fact, how much you charging him? Shit, I might need that. That's. I know you got the hood prices. <laughs> <laughs> Word. I need, I need my brakes done. I've done that so many times, bro. See, a, you see a fool doing saying, "Oh shit." Yo, what you doing? Well, not what you doing. Yo, I, yo, you you do that? You always do that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I work around here, man. Yo, what, I need. I got this car. I need that done. How much? Hundred, man. I'm gonna bring it right now. <laughs> yo, I went to the, um my pop's car didn't want to start, and I was like, fuck. So you know, there's only certain things that you have to check. So I check. I'm like, all right, the battery's good. Starter like the I can hear the starter engaging, so it's not the starter. So it's like, all right, it's either the fuel, air, or a spark. So I check the spark plugs; they all work. Like I, I, I changed one of the things. It's getting air. I bought a fucking fuel, fuel uh, gauge. I took over on the fuel lines of the fucking spark plug of the, the the thing. Plugged it in there, started the car up. No pressure. I was like, yo, the fuel pump's gone. And I was like, all right, let's let's go buy a fuel pump. I'll change it. The day I went to change it, because we had to get it towed to my pops, you know, to the house. Yo, that chain, that day, it was, I think, 15 degrees outside. Oh, no. And I was like, yo, if I get gas on my hands, I'm getting frostbite. You know that shit evaporates and then it's cold and all that other shit. So we went to a mechanic. My next door neighbor knew him. So we got a tow. We went to the mechanic. I said, yo. How much is it to just change the fuel pump? He goes, it's this price, but how do you know it's a fuel pump? And I told him everything I did. He goes, you want a job? I was like, you got, you got health insurance? He's like, nah. I was like, nah, man, I'm good. This is when I just started working at, at, at Columbia. So it was like, nope. you know what I'm saying? But yeah, this dude, that ass was like, where you did all this shit? It was like, in front of my pop's job. He's like, you want a job? I was like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I wish you should have heard me two, three years ago. Yeah, when I was fucking unemployed for five years. Mm-hmm. Well, two, I was it was two years, but still, it felt like five. It could have been less if you could have came to me. Word. I'm I'm I'm, I'm becoming like that. I am kind of lazy. Well, I'm not kind of. Oh shit, Pacquiao. Pacquiao. He don't even look like Pacquiao. He old man. He, he, he a governor now. He should be out there fighting like Mayweather. I'm making money. You know, Where? fighting little kids. Mm. Boop, boop, beep. <laughs> hey, man, I like the fact that we got the new generation coming here. They're fighting and, you know, something, man. They, they, they're not as fast as me and I'm not going to But it, I stay humble and I, I'm a legend now. Thank you very much. I'm getting in there. Fuck it. <laughs> Yo. I saw the last fight where this guy knocked out Mama Huevo, and I'm I, I want to fight him now. Yeah, he he dangerous, but I knock him out. I knock him out too. Okay. I see where the problem is. One two uppercut. 
Sugar Ray Leonard. Well, is it Sugar Ray Leonard? That is Sugar Ray Leonard. Uh, Pacquiao. Ladies and gentlemen, stop. Trent, stop thinking Pacquiao's coming back. He looks old and presidential. Matter of fact, he even looked like he got a couple of Filipino bodyguards. Who's that guy back there with the glasses? <laughs> That's Luke. Word, big ass Filipino. Just staring at everybody. Back up. No, you can't get picture back out. He's doing really business. Word. Look, the big dude and there's this like two other Filipinos right next to him. Yeah, and then you got the, the Kung Fu Master right over this guy's left shoulder. Word, he saw it, right? Hello? Yeah. Who, the, the kid in the stand? All right, yo, get him out of here. My man looking like Bolo over here, staring at the TV. Like, I, I understand Thor and Shaw make fun of Paco. I'll go fuck him up. Word, I fuck anybody up right now. Nah, I'm guessing he's not with him. He's taking pictures of Pacquiao and shit. What up, normal guy? How you feeling, brother? Oh shit, to he said. Normal guy. He said the next next event we gotta get a mama huevo chain going. Word. Mama huevo. Mama huevo. <laughs> mama penga. <laughs> Girl, fuck you, Mama Webble. Mari Kong, Mama Pinga. Hey, no more me guy. Me 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 Yo, get this shit, show. This shit, I formatted it, right? So I changed the format of the, the thing because they said it was going to be fast. So I plug it into my iPad. Still slower than shit. That so my. Hard drive? Yeah. So get this. I bought. This is the one I had, 128 gigs. Yo, this shit works perfectly. So I said, fuck it. Buy two of these. I bought one of these. Micro Center Type C, 256 gig. Plug, plug it in. It's faster than this shit, but it's still not as fast as the Samsung. So I said, fuck it. It's on sale. I bought two of them, 256. Plug it in. Yo, transfer rates fast. I go to open up the file. Forever to open up. That's the problem. It doesn't like all my my shit I put up there. The the folder don't open up. I'm like, fuck it. Uh, I don't know. I, yeah, I was like, you know what? And and the thing is, Cruz has the same problem. So it's like, it's not me. You smart. So buy those two Samsungs to download on, and then transfer them over to the other two memory cards to watch them on. No, oh you know goodness. what? Yeah, you know what I was, you know what I did? I said, fuck it. I made a new folder. I burnt the computer. <laughs> I said, cause I can't open up this folder. I made a new folder and I'm putting everything I need into the new folder and then I'll plug it into my PC and transfer the shit that's in the new folder into the old folder and I always got the new folder empty. <laughs> and you like, what the fuck? The new folder's so empty that it works perfect. <laughs> yeah. Like Damn, the Nets are out of it. My man, normal guy, just woke up from his nap. He was... <laughs> My man had the little... <laughs> the lip and everything. <laughs> <laughs> what a beautiful... You know how good that feels to nap. Maybe I'm getting old. Well, I'm lying. I always was like that. Yeah, but I got a nap for like four or five hours. That's what I was going to say. I don't cat nap. That's the only problem. I lose the whole day. I'll fall asleep at four and wake up at twelve on a knowing I gotta work the next day. Fuck. <laughs> whole day destroyed. Hey, my man Ray said enough for the text say the text segment on the toe in the show. Make sure you right. get a nice sure SMB mic. See how we sound so proper. What? Yo, bro, I was going to buy one, and I was like, fuck it. I bought the TV for my living room with that, the money I had, so I, I used my credit card, and I just paid that shit off. 
And I'm like, I don't think I need a short some seven B on my shit. Nope, you would have been so tight. No TV and another fucking mic. To be honest with you, they say it's better, and you'd have probably heard a little difference. But you it's like, I wait until we fucking super, super, if we fucking super lost, man. We super lost. I wait until we super famous. We'll wait until somebody will be like, yo, we sent you that shit. All right, no. Word. Yo, we gifted you that. I've seen people, well, I've seen, not that we want anything. i just seen a lot Fuck of people. that now. <laughs> I've seen streamers yeah. like, yo, I need this. Oh, my cousin, this person got it for me. So Word. if we get to that point, it would be dope. Word. Or when we get to that point. Let me say it right. I need a drink before the mass starts, though. You can't drink. Cause they it's keep, against the law. They doing the Monday Night Raw right now. They got a fucking picture of the fight up for like half an hour. Yo, this that's probably what that's happen. probably what happened. We didn't freeze. They were just talking with the yeah, picture up. Yeah, yeah, we fucked up. We thought we fucked up. This picture's been up for half an hour. Yeah, this is the fight that's gonna happen. But while it happens, let's talk. Listen, this is what he did last night, last fight. Or let me show you something. Okay. Three, three hours later. <laughs> no wonder they only had three matches. Yo, it's funny how people go, oh, they fought both of them, and they said that Davis doesn't punch that hard. It's like, well, it looked like he punched hard to me because he's knocking these niggas out. Who said My that? man sat him down. You saw that just now? He sat yeah. him down. Who said that? Some fighters that fought them. I don't know their names. Mama uh, Huevo and uh, Un Piño de Gron. Well, let's judge the knockouts then. Because you're gonna we're watching the recaps now, so you get you know how Tank fights, because obviously that's your guy. But then we'll see the recap of Ryan and we'll see if he knocks people out like that. Damn, he did a backflip. Never mind, he won. <laughs> 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 he could do a backflip. Tie game. Walk off home run. What, you watching the fucking baseball too? Everything. I got the phone, the TV, Aaron Judge the Kablam. Grab three run home run to win the game. 450. I thought you just said they tied it. Nah. It was three to three to two in the ninth, and he hit a three run home run. A walk off home run to win the game. Yeah. So you're telling me that Aaron Judge can't get it, can't win the 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 World Series, but he can win the game. Yeah, I mean, yeah. So Philly Philly beat Brooklyn. They cheated. Yeah, they 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 swept Brooklyn. They came with a broom. Oh, the Lakers are beating Memphis 50 to 24 in the second quarter. Memphis beat who? The Lakers are beating Memphis. What? I mean, the Lake, yeah, the Lakers are beating Memphis 50 to 24 in the second quarter. Damn. What? Yeah. What Phoenix up? beat LA 112 to 100. So they're leading 3 to 1 in the series. I saw that game. They cheated. My, LA Miami, none of they players. Miami beat the Bucks one twenty one to ninety nine. They're leading in the series two one. Okay, I pick. And then tomorrow the the Knicks and the Warriors and the Celtics and the Nuggets play. So tomorrow the Knicks are gonna win, and I don't care who uh, the two teams. He said the Knicks are going to win and fuck everybody else. Right. And. Girl, fuck you, Mama Webble. <laughs> Body cold, Mama Pingo. Who you got, Tank or Garcia? I got Tank. And I got uh, Garcia. I'm surprised he didn't break his neck <laughs> with that backflip shit. 
Bird, he scared the shit out of me. Come on, man. We trying to see this fight. Get off of there. <laughs> Word. My man's like, yo, that that first fight wasn't supposed to happen he did so the fast. Goldberg. So they got to make up for that. Did the Goldberg knock himself out in the back. Group. Ah, I fell on my neck. Oh, my well. <laughs> I can't fight after this. <laughs> I don't got no neck. <laughs> hey, I know how that feels. <laughs> uh oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, right when I said, "Fuck it," let me put on the UFC. Time. What's happening? Yeah, let, me let me go get that. Yeah, I mean Garcia. Oh, the Yank, uh, the Rangers and the the Devils are in overtime. The Rangers are leading 2-0 in the series. Nice. It's 1-1. One, one. Yo, Garcia doesn't even need to win this fight. Oh, shit, yeah. What, yo, we almost got uh, fucking Matt Awesome to, to put you through the table yesterday. Yo, but Garcia doesn't even need to win this fight. He's already... He just needs to look good to establish himself as a star. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh, well, they ain't even live. Yeah, who's doing the walkout for this nigga? I see it would be fine with a win or a loss, but yeah, but it definitely would solidify him. Yeah, if he wins, it, yo, Dave, it's gonna hurt Davis more if Garcia wins than if Davis won and Garcia lost. You know what I'm saying? Because all he got to do is show that he's he's real, and then people will back him up. Because you know, a loss ain't gonna hurt him. A loss will hurt Davis though. Because then he's going to do a lot. He's going to have to do a lot to go back to where he was at. You know what I'm saying? Because look at uh, Adrian Broner. Adrian Broner was talking mad shit. He, he lost his first fight and he never was the same. Yo, my man, he's trying to put people to sleep with this century song. Yo, I am so surprised. Yo, Ray, I don't know if you remember the story of me throwing my cup against the wall and the soda went into the to the mat, my ring mat. Bro, I am so surprised that the steam mop actually fucking cleaned that shit. Like it was brand new. <laughs> That's crazy. LeBron just just blocked Le John Moran's shot. You know what's funny? I'm over here watching the fucking Rangers game. I'm watching the fucking Rangers game and shit. Yo, show we trying to get Ray through the table. 
and nobody want to throw him through the table. Then Janelle was like, you got to bring your own table. I said, I'm going to bring my own table. That'll be dope. And why Ray? I thought you was trying to put me. You ain't there. Girl, fuck you, Mama Webber. I'm up with your puta. Oh, shit. Tank coming out with his whole family. Hold on. Where? I like his colors. He got the jokers. Yeah. It's showtime, baby. Damn, this nigga's coming out with the only lip singer. Oh, boy, The mumbo shit. Yeah, man, yo, that 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 steam mop clean my mat real good. Why he look like he got safari walking out with him? I hope not. Because <laughs> I don't feel like he losing. He came out with safari, he lose. You lose. Name my cup but boy. Yo, you gonna watch the new Fast and Furious movie? I am just for entertainment value. May nineteenth. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna watch it. It's a Damn movie, man. Let's, so let's, let's let's watch it like a movie. Like let, they should they could be out of space in movies. It's okay. Why people want to be so realistic? Where? Take my fucking brain on a ride, and I understand it's a movie. I'm not a kid no more. Chief Keith. Yo. His advice to Leonard Ella B, man. He's funny. That's the guy fucking... Mayweather's guy. Yeah, he told me, <laughs> shut up. You a bitch-ass nigga. <laughs> Oh, wait, he told that to Adrian Broner? No, nah, Adrian Broner said that. Oh. He's like, there's a lot of people around here against me. You, Ellen Ellenby, I know you're against me. You a bitch-ass nigga. You're right in the day to me. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta look it up. This guy can say human made? I hope. He's supposed to be a robot. Human made heart. I guess. Damn, show this shit starting to hurt. You got this show. You got some brain. Mute. A little, a little wing with the, with, with the blue teeth. Nice. All right, let's look at the tail of the tape. Bro can eat a peach for hours. 28, age 28, 24. Tank is 50, uh, 5'5. Five, five. Ryan is 5'8. Tank, they both weigh 135. And Ryan is going to have a three three inch reach as Ryan is. Two and a half inch reach as Ryan. Two and a half. You know I can't count. Yo, imagine being a 135 pound show. The wind knocked you over. I used to be that when I was. Five? No, I'm not. Yeah, like seven, eight years old. About. But that was a lot. The doctor was worried. Yeah. The doctor was like, "Yo, you sexy though, so you hold mm -hmm. that that weight." They were like, "We're gonna fix our machine in the machine room." I said, "Baka boy, boy, baka baka blow boy, 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 you get like a toe boy." Doctor gave my mom on the cue. That's enough. <laughs> Put him down. <laughs> we can't have this. We're taking him away from you. Who this nigga in the pink? Wanna be? You wanna be in everybody business? April 20, yeah, big George Foreman. I want to see that shit too. Muted. Me, me as well. 
the new Insidious trailer. If it's a horror movie trailer, I did not see it. Show doesn't like horror movies, so we don't watch show trailers. Girl, fuck you, Mama Webble. Mama Kong, Mama Ping. Mama Kong, Mama Ping. Side. You're out of New York. I'm excited for this one. They, I even like the style. Where? Oh, there's a New Jersey judge. You know that motherfucker dirt. That's it. It's over. They lost. They both uh, lost. It's yep. a draw. It is a draw. But I knocked them up. Uh, it is a draw. <laughs> <laughs> My man, Thomas Taylor. Who is what you? You you know that motherfucker can't ref. Never seen them before. Oh, Battle of Undefeated Superstars running in the West Indian Run Run Boxing Now. DraftKings gonna put money up. They put the whole ring. Where? Yo, is is Devontae Davis with the money team or no? He used to be. But that is uh, the Mayweather's manager. manager. Yeah. Come on, Davis. I don't want you cheering that you just dunking. Because we know you're about to fucking roll your ankle and be out for two more seasons. My man made out of fucking movie glass. Was it? Sugar glass. Remember that shit? Sugar glass. That shit break like a motherfucker. Yo, did you see the video of the dude who popped the, the cop in the head with the bottle? And he just walked up on her and said, Pook. You heard the pook. And then he dropped the bottle and it shattered on the ground. And she was like, oh, and ran. And then the other cops, like, jumped him. Mm -mm. And he just said, oh, pow. <laughs> he just popped her. He should have just said, kluk, and ran. <laughs> you know, the old kluk, and ran. Shit. He wasn't Dominican. That's how you do it in the eye. Man. Oh, my. Ah! <laughs> Oh, that's made with her. Yeah. Damn. We're watching uh, Tank versus Garcia. Yo, that's crazy. Mayweather's like, yo, not only am I going to fuck up De La Hoya, not only is my promotion team going to fuck up De La Hoya, but my box is going to fuck up De La Hoya's box. That's crazy. Man, that hurt. Not only did I fuck you up, my boxer fucked your box up. I brought my, my chickens into your chicken fight. My chicken <laughs> fucked your shit up. <laughs> my, my business fucked up your business. Everything. I want all the money. <laughs> it worked. Yeah, I take a shit in your bathroom. I'm not touching your glove, fam. Fuck out of here. Or I don't like your fucking gloves. Touch me now. Gloves. This is the last time you're gonna touch me. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> Word. Tweet, 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 tweet. You don't even know where I'm at. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's showtime. Right, let's to do go. this. Let's see who's the man. Y'all been talking all this shit for years. Don't be scared. You want to fuck on me? You you been trying to fuck on me? <laughs> now nah, let's fight. Well, my man Davis said, you ain't fast. Man, that shit all right. That little slap out. Yeah, yeah, keep him at bay, B. You bigger than him. Boop, beep. Don't be scared. I ain't going to show I you think, my power. Well, I'll tell you one thing, though. Uh, Garcia is not intimidated. Oh, nah. He's the bigger boxer. He has to be. 
he has he has to impose it. He can't lay take tank sit there and punch him. But you are all right, my friend. He does look comfortable. Hopefully, it doesn't change with a slap. Hoopleek. Oh no, I'm not comfortable Man. no more. Emergency. I ain't afraid of. <laughs> Don't be rude. <laughs> Would you stop it? No. <laughs> right now they're doing the little test out. We yeah. gonna test that. Let me see. Ooh, 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 ooh. And Wante Davis is like, I want to see what this dude got. So he's just letting him. He's measuring him. He's letting him. He's letting him jab. He's seeing what he does after the jab. And Garcia is just like, well, I'm just gonna jab, and show you a little bit of my speed. Oh, see, Ooh, Davis is like, look, you're the only fast one. Uh, right, I brought this with me. <laughs> he said, he said, oh, you think you tall? What? Your forehead? Not no more. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I, t I think I tell you the strategy because he a De La Hoya fighter. So De La Hoya used to do this trick where he used to hit you for like six rounds, where like seventy percent. Yeah. And then in the seventh round, 100. <laughs> <laughs> Word. I, I never felt that. Got him. Where that came from? I told you. I got tricks, my oh, friend. Oh, you think I don't know how to fight, but uh, let me tell you something. It's okay. Welcome to the 2023 NFL Draft Tone Show. Appreciate it. Oh, shit. That started today. Let me know who the Jets get. They didn't start today. Uh, That's first. Isn't um Thursday the fight? Uh, the draft? It sounds like it's today. According to normal guy, we already got Aaron Rodgers. With shit. the number one draft pick. Yo, I don't know what's up with that shit. He playing mm -hmm. games like he did with the Packers, but he gonna be hit. Watch. I can tell because there was a guy that went to Atlanta and he said Aaron Rodgers reached out to him to try to bring him to the Jets. Like, yo, come on. We can, we can win a championship. So he obviously coming. He just playing the game. He plays that same game with the Packers. Matter of fact, he's already playing the game because he already told the, the Jets that he's not showing up for like the, the mini camp. Like he usually shows up like the first week of preseason. He don't want to do all that exercise. Fuck him. Who the hell is this white dude in there? Looking like he's a chef. Yeah, listen, my friend. When I tried to make the tortellini, it was no good. Murr. That's a good, that's a, the, the thing about boxing. It's good they have 12 rounds of fight because if there was only three rounds, five rounds, that was a wasted round. But, uh, you know, they, they're out there, they, they, they're pacing themselves, they, they, and measuring everybody up and making sure that they, you know, they get the speed and shit like that. All right, round two. Bing! Okay, Garcia's unloading. Man, hitting him with them rabbit punches. Garcia's like, fuck this. You muted. I said he hurt. He yeah, holding he... on. Look, look. Don't hold Watch. on to me, sucker. Let He's go hitting him me. with them rabbit punches. Bitch ass nigga. What's all that shit you was talking shit up? Yeah, don't run now. What's up? Yeah, what you said about my mama, B? Oh, that was a that was a fast left hook. That's, so. that's the phantom. That's the same shit he yeah, got with another kid with the, the elbow. Listen, we gonna hit him with the feet. We Mexican, baby. Yeah, you see him running. Don't be scared. Yeah, cause he cause he knows. Garcia right now is determining the pace. He's 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 
picking the pace up, and my man Tank is trying to he's trying to slow him down, keep the 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 pace Ooh. at his pace. Yeah, I think he saw that. Oh, this nigga just threw a he, he threw an uppercut while he's selling the ref like he hit me in the back of the head. You think you slick? He 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 fighting like somebody is getting his ass whoop. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Don't don't get down. Ooh, what happened? Whoa! What happened? No. <laughs> We was getting his ass whooped. He was getting his ass whooped, show. Say he fight like he's getting Ryan. Oh. Chill, baby. <laughs> oh, no. That level is overcommitted. He overcommitted. He overcommitted. Davis overcommitted. Ooh, I got to get up for this. Shit got serious now. Hold on. I'm on the floor, mama. Well, now he's scared. He hit me, mama. I don't Ooh, know where there you go. Now Davis is is is. Come on, Ryan! He's starting to fight back. Come on, baby! Come on, Ryan! Hold Boy, on! It's been a while since I saw a fight this good in in boxing. Ooh, this she only just second got round. Word, she just got real serious though. He hit the ground. Now, are you man, bleeding? My man said you can throw all the rabbit punches. You want to left hook? Where you saw tank, you bleeding. Wipe your mouth. <laughs> Put no more guy in the ring. There you go. <laughs> no more guy, you would have been dead. <laughs> beep, beep. Yeah, that was a problem. Yo, Le Garcia kept throwing left hooks. Yeah, that's he threw, the trick. He threw three left hooks. He missed it and he timed it. Look, whoop, bah, yeah, because yeah, he kept ducking under it. And the thing what is, what a beautiful punch. Davis sees that. Yo, in the in the old access, he's like, yo, why this guy keep throwing the same fucking. Straight right hand, straight right hand, straight right hand, and he said, "Fuck it, Doma." Doma. What a beautiful punch! Bang! Hold Yo, that. LeBron James is on the floor holding his nuts. Hold that. He's, he's like, "My baby, my baby." My man, send them to Cinco de Mayo, and it's only April. Bang. Hold that. I used to box back in my day. Okay. You see him bartender gave me two Coronas and a shot of tequila. <laughs> I'm not the part and the fool. I'm the ref. Oh, yo, he definitely caught him with that Thoma. Oh my boy, Fleco. Yo, I was doing that shit yesterday. Every time they child was like Thoma, 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 Thoma. Oh, this dude just nut checked LeBron. He did a left hook to LeBron nuts. Hold a minute. Are we watching a fight? Or are we watching a fight? I'm watching the fight in the game. That's what I said. <laughs> Which fight? I didn't see no nut check. <laughs> <laughs> LeBron tried to cross him and my say, Oh, you got, you got, oh, you got I'm no I see how it is. Yeah. You want to watch the Yankee game in the fight? You watch the, the Laker game in the fight. I see how it is. You could have chose something better than the damn Lakers. Well, you know something? I was watching the Ranger game, but then I was like, the let, me, let me see oh. this motherfucker talking shit to LeBron. Oh, my. I picked straight, the, oh, straight he keep using that fucking punch. Be careful. Yeah, straight left hand, right? That shit is fast. Oh, that shit was quick. Look, he don't even want to punch. He's scared. Because if I let go of this hand, he going to hit me again. Oh, no. So this is getting scary because now he's... Once the fucking tie changes and the other guy starts pushing, it's over. I'm yep. scared. What's the, what's the time on your, on your thing? I'm at 133. 133. Same thing. All right, all right. So we're we watching this at the same time. Yeah, because as soon as you said, oh, it was the same thing. Same thing. Same punk. Same, same knock punk. Out. I knock him out because he a bitch. Yes. Now I want Bandejo next. Now he's fighting like a... What is that word you use? Like a pando blau. Pando blau. <laughs> you don't want to throw no punches. You don't want... Hey. Word. Matter of fact, let me get my money back. Hold on. My man gets, gets hit. Yo, he started the second round like Pancho Villa. He gets punched, and now he's he's back to being George. They were, <laughs> my, my man came out like this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hit me no more. Please. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> uh, it wasn't me. It was De La Hoya. <laughs> De La Hoya is the one that don't like Mayweather. I love Mayweather. I love Mayweather. black people. I love black people. <laughs> <laughs> My, oh my. Look, my best friend is black. <laughs> no, it don't matter how fast you are, my man's ducking your left hook like crazy. 
Yo, you saw the security just run past all them people? Yeah, somebody fighting. Yeah, somebody doing something. Everybody look, look, look at everybody. You saw that? Yep. Fuck go on, go on there. Oh, shit. It's in a, a fight within the fight. Come on, Ryan. Ooh, you look okay. scared as fuck. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Dyke. Bro, that left hook, he rolled with it, though. Uh, still, the speed. Yo, he heard, he heard the click clacks and was like, "All right, let me let me throw punches." Yo, that right hook was look fast though. Shoom. Yeah, he's just scared. He gonna hit yeah. me again, and then it's over. Oh shit, Tyson's there. I told you. I told you that Mexican wanted to right. fight. Him. Yo, and now they do fucking sit in front of the camera. Burn. Look at this guy. This guy, I don't think he's a fucking... This guy is a hairdresser. Listen, Bobby, yeah. your, your hair is fucked up. I'm That's Gordon Ramsay. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you looking... Watch out for the left up, girl. There's a lot of... Uh, remember, put the, steak in the, put the steak in the in the oven for 30 minutes before you sear it. Who is this guy? <laughs> this guy, look, he never fought in his life. See, this is a real fighter. You looking beautiful, baby. Listen. Put the water in your balls. Beep, beep. Come on, baby. Yo, when the coach look like he could fuck up the fight, you fighting, you got a good coach. Hell yeah. <laughs> my man, let me buy them gloves. Oh, what's up? <laughs> or my man look like he's an Elvis impersonator. Nah, hey, listen, baby. Or you got to go down to Heartbreak out. Hotel, baby. You going to, you know, return the center, baby. I think he's just here for the money. We or, found this guy outside the hotel. Yo, <laughs> you fit in this? My man is talking to the ref. He's like, yo, you want to stop a ref? He's a little bitch. He's scared. He ain't ready to fight. I hope he's trying to set him up. Like, I'm going to act scared. I'm oh, gonna that, like he's out of Sonya? Yeah. I'm a, I don't yeah. think Davis is as stupid as, as Pereira to fall for it. But. Yeah, I'm going to act like I'm scared. I'm going to act like I'm hurt. I'm going to act like I'm shivering. Man, that punch was beautiful, man. And then out of nowhere, fuck your punch. Kaplop! Sucker. Come oh, on. You saw that? The word. My man got him back for that one. You remember that day in the basement? Blip. Ah! You want to fuck on me? Yo, that's crazy. It's true what Tyson said. Everybody got a plan till you get punched. My yep. man, you could tell the plan. He was pushing forward. He's going to hit him with that left hook. Soon as he got dropped. Uh, plan B. Run. Defense. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I've only felt that Yo, one last thing. The thing is, it still would work. Just stop throwing that fucking left hook so often. I think he is. I haven't seen that left hook. Oh, since. shit. But Davis is down again. It's not Davis, Garcia. No, 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 Davis. Anthony Davis is down again. My man, turn that shit off. You scaring me. I'm like, where? <laughs> you know they got the same name. The one thing I do see that I don't like, when he's getting punched, he turns like awkwardly. Like it's an Ooh. awkward turn. That's how he got dropped. Him, uh, Garcia. Oh, Garcia? You're going to see. He like turns... It's a funny turn. Like his whole body and his he look like a fucking possum. Like he looks so out of balance when he does that. Yeah. There it is. Look, you see? Yeah, yeah. It's like a turn. It's a flinch. <clears throat> yeah, he flinches. Like it's it's weird. I don't like that. It, it yeah, it's like yeah, he, he doesn't want to get hurt while he yeah. gets hit. Yeah, I like you turn was, off this fucking. What the fuck? Nah, you can watch it. I was just fucking with you. No, I'm turning off because I was like, I'm tired of seeing these motherfuckers on the ground. I turn around, LeBron's on the ground. I turn around again, Anthony Davis on the ground. Like you're not fuck that man. I want to watch this fight. I want to watch that fight. We gonna win by any means necessary. Everybody on the floor. We gonna break his ankle. We are gonna bust his balls. Oh, you see the new strategy? He's gonna try to take the last ten seconds. Yeah. He just turned into a different fighter those last 10 seconds. Yeah, the last round, he did that too. He heard the clack, clack, clack. Yeah, you told me. Ooh, hold that. Yeah. Oh, he's a way better boxer. Look, he tried to turn him around and everything. Bleep. Walk up. Yeah, Tank is way better as a boxer. You see his hit and move. Look, look, I'm over here, homie. Look, look, who are you swinging at? 
<laughs> he said, hold on, wait, I'm over here. Marco, Polo. <laughs> Pacquiao's like, fuck. I know what to do. <laughs> in fact, I was like, fuck. I should have teamed up with Mayweather when he told me about it before in the, in the hotel room. Fuck y'all. Yeah, Mayweather's like, I don't even need to watch this fight. I know what's happening. Mayweather walking around like he fight. He chilling. Word. So when the show is at the fight tonight, baby. Ain't nothing better than the toe on the show at a fight. Word. Ladies and gentlemen, for the ho- those that do not know, we are watching the Ryan Tank fight. Yo, imagine last night you was with us, with me screaming the way I was screaming, and you be fucking as funny as you are, and Ray over there fucking telling everybody, tell me to shut up. Or Ray Ray and over there. Yeah. Shit, I, I saw I saw Ray. He was he was telling me like, yo, put put son in toes drink. Or one little tablet. Yeah. Or the pudding pop. Bill Cosby. Ooh, Toma in the body shot. So if you look at this, right? You see the uh Devontae Davis, his outside foot is on the outside of Garcia's foot. So that means his left hand is in line with Garcia's face. Garcia's right hand is out. He has to over rotate that right hand to hit tank. Those are those little things that a seasoned vet does. You know what I'm saying? Because now it's like you're a little bit more out of range. You got to overreach now with that punch. That's so you're going to extend now. You know what I'm saying? And that's why Garcia could move out of the way of that lightning fast fucking left hook because that shit ain't going straight. That shit ain't going straight. That shit's going night, you know, fucking curved. It's a curveball. Yeah. Garcia is just scared to take a punch after he punches, because that's what happened. Yeah. And he doesn't know how to punch without... Like, he doesn't have what Tank has. You see how Tank will throw a punch and then he'll duck? I haven't seen Garcia do all at once. Like, throw a punch, duck, move. Because Garcia is putting everything into the shot. He th- You saw that left hook? Yeah. Garcia yeah. rotated with that punch. He He's trying to knock him out with every punch. I said it. Yeah. I said it. He's overhyped. He's too excited for this fight. He's overthrowing. Like, he's putting too much power in this punch, and I get it. But, bro, you you can't just throw the left hook out of nowhere. Or you can't lead with that left hook at 100, 100 fucking percent. You're you know, going to over-rotate, and then, then he's going to come with two pop-up. You know what I'm saying? You know what's crazy? Because you remember, you can also... Oh, my man said, ole. Yeah, that's that's boxing. That's all boxing. Yeah. Look, see? It's like, yo, you can win the fight without knocking him out. That's all. His box. I, I noticed his boxing was superior within the first few minutes. I'm like, whoa. Yeah. This is not good. See, but that, that's what happens when you're when you're a one trick pony. He's like Garcia is fast and he's getting knockouts because of the speed. But it's like, okay, now what? When I neutralize your speed, when with my positioning, what happens now? What you gonna do? We'll see, bro. All it takes is one mistake. It's true, but. It's very rare you see Davis make that mistake. He ain't he ain't Usman. Oh nah. I see what Davis doing. He's ducking. You saw how he went. He was so close to that arm that even if he hit him with that left hook, it wasn't gonna be strong. Yeah. Like he needs to use his he needs to use his distance. Keep him with the jab. Clap. Damn, Mario Lopez is in every fucking picture. Yeah, he's sitting next he's to Pac Al and uh, now Wahlberg. Damn, soon enough they're going to show a picture of Tyson. There's fucking this nigga. How the hell he's sitting next to everybody? Come on, Ryan. Don't be scared, bro. It's okay to get dropped. You just got to be a champ and take it, take it and keep. You drop me, I'm going to drop you twice. What's up? See the thing, the thing that you can do to neutralize Davis is smother him. Is you got to have a controlled chaos. Can't keep throwing that same fucking punch. He's gonna time it. Ah, you should have worked on. Yo, Davis said, "Oh, you guys, that left hook." 
and he threw that left that left hook like seventeen times a, a fucking round. And he's like, "Oh, all I need is a left hook." Like apparently, you need a little bit more than that. There goes the right hand catches him. There you go. Ooh, See, okay. stop throwing the Ooh, fucking left hook, and then you do something. What's up? What's up? You beat control chaos. Fucking put the pressure on him, but do something that he ain't gonna expect. That's smart. Use your right hand to make him forget about your left. Yeah, he's looking for it. Because you got to set it up. Mm -hmm. So the jab's there. Get your distance. Set up your fucking punches. Don't just throw a fucking left hook out of nowhere. You're not going to catch him. Not him. You remember that thing that you've been scared of? I'm going to show it to you in three, two, blah, blah. (laughs) Oh, shit. I forgot. Oh, Oh. shit. What happened? My shit turned green. Me too. Come on, Toe. You fucking shit up. Hey, no, nah, that's that's fucking Garrett Diaz, that motherfucker. That motherfucker, he got both of our streams. <laughs> we're, we're, hey, we're he's trying back. to end this quick. Yeah, he is. I hope he practiced with like a, ooh, he finally made a miss. But he's so good, such he's such a good boxer that he was still like he still was balanced. Yeah. He's not overcommitting. He's just trying yeah. to land the punches. Yeah. Brian Garcia missed and he had him. He was so turnt. He didn't even see the punch coming. Yo, Ryan Garcia is throwing punches. That, oh, there goes another left hook. Ooh. Yeah, but that right hook, if he if he throws it, that right hook is catching him. Yeah. For the right straight. But he's throwing that left hook with fucking authority. Every other punch he's throwing to land. Okay, that body pot, that body punch Ooh, was good. Yeah, okay, he's he's starting. I'm gonna I'm gonna start one punch at a time, baby. It's twelve rounds. We got six more. What's up? Word. Oh, you, you don't like them rabbit punches, huh, motherfucker? Man, why are you trying to cover up like Mike Tyson? I mean, like like Mayweather. You ain't got it. That's a much better round for for Garcia. It was because he actually was throwing something other than that left hook. If he could fight like that, he might be able to catch up. Because if yeah. he, he needs to fight like that for three rounds, and then okay, he's using something else. I forgot about the left hook, and then in the twelfth, eleventh round, you remember that one thing you was telling me about? But David saw it. You see, right. Davis Davis squinch for it. It was too fast though. It caught him. See, he shook his head. Well, because yeah. look, he was already out of position. Like, it's hard to move when you're already in that moving shit. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. That was a perfect, that was a good fucking timing of a punch. Yeah, but he wasn't, his legs was off the floor. If he would have been. Who the fuck are they? I don't know. The like Guava Yang? Twins? Yin and Yang? Aren't those the sh- shaking like a salt pepper name? <laughs> oh, my bad. I thought there was a yin yang thing. Round seven. Okay. Oh, shit, you cheating, fam. You got blades on your glove. Where? No, I don't. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, now you're overcommitted. Yeah. See, too much. He got excited because the first one was boop. This guy like a little kid. Yep. I, I did it, mama. <laughs> My man hit it with one punch and turned around to celebrate. I did it, mama. He's still behind you. <laughs> All right, so if Ryan Garcia wins now. I can make some money because I put that Ryan Garcia was gonna win, and that he's gonna it was gonna go after the seventh round. So if he was saving some magic, which I doubt it, it's Wait. time to bring it out. Is it after like starting the eighth round or starting the seventh round? Uh, oh, okay, that was a nice combination. There it is. Uh, that I don't know because. It like the bet was exactly like that. Ryan Garcia to win, and the fight to go more than seven rounds. So I don't know if it has to go after seventh 
Why your eyes went like that? What happened? He took a knee. I'm a minute and 22 seconds left in the, in the seventh round. Me too. I see the knee. I just saw your eyes. Bro, the fight is over. What the fuck happened? Word. I looked at you for a second, and then I saw your eyes. My shit froze. Me too. That's it. The fucking cameraman just dropped the camera. Fuck this. What happened? Fuck them up. That man is dangerous. Now we need to see him against David Haney. <laughs> that sucks. Every time he wins, yeah, now we need somebody else. <laughs> like, can't, like, he's good. All right, let's give it to him. Yo, what did I tell ya? What I did I tell ya? What happened, fam? Tag, do the backflip now. I told you, once I saw that backflip earlier, I was like, oh, shit, I lost my money. <laughs> hey, look, Mayweather probably, like I told you, get that body shot in there. You ain't going to be able to stand. Fuck that tall shit. My man did that backflip. I said, take my money. Hey, you win. Yo, I want to see this replay of this body shot. They don't even want to show it. I think this is fucking fake. Five. Oh, shit. Toe went into the fucking background. He about to call Mayweather himself. Yo, yo, send us the video. Hold on. I got Mayweather on the line. Yo. <laughs> we need to interview him for the knucklehead. What the fuck? Why, they, why he pushed this white guy like that? Yo, this white guy is hurt. Yo, everybody in the fucking show is saying the same thing. It was so fast, it was a ghost punch. We don't... What the fuck happened? Ladies and gentlemen, the fight is over. Here we go, replay. That little fucking punch? You shitting me. My man got hit with a little baby punch, Toe. Nah, this is this is rigged. This is rigged or he's fake. He 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 knew he was losing or something. Like, yo, this nigga gonna kill me. My man hit him. That's the softest punch of the fight. Look. Look, 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 look. He, that, he didn't even hit him right. He didn't even hit him right. Bro, that, this is rigged. Let me see this again from up close. Nah, that has to be the softest punch of the fight. It was a perfect spot, though. I, that, that was the softest punch of the night. I, it might have hurt, but it, was, it looked soft. The, the one to the face was a lot harder. For you to take a knee and then wait for the referee to stop the fight, like, at least if you're going to take a knee to rest, yo, I'm taking a knee because that hurt. As soon as I hear, hey, I'm back, let me take a breather. But he ain't even try to get up. He's like, nah, I'm done. I'm done. Toe is speechless. You, you mute it. Right, 
Quack? 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 Can you hear me? Nah, I can't hear you. Uh, try to see if the stream hears you. I was meaning. There you go. I was saying, my pops, that one punch, because it's funny, because I said that punch looked like it, it hurt, and you responded to me, so I thought you heard me. No, no, no. No, but, um, yeah, my pops tried to raise the volume, and he changed the complete output of the speed, of the audio. <laughs> I'm like, it's just an arrow. Press up. That's it. <laughs> I don't know why you go into the settings and all this other shit. My man said it's just an arrow. Please. Please help me. Help me out, please. <laughs> this is the easy part of life. Please. He didn't reach the counter tap. He was like, it's over. That was a good fight. But once he felt the power, Garcia was like, I'm good. Burn. Everything has changed. I would have kept going with the same game plan. If I'm going to lose, I'm going to lose. You're going to fuck me up with my game plan. I'm going to keep doing the same shit. What's up? I'm going to go right back to it. I hate how he talks, bro. He is so illiterate. Yeah. Like, I heard an interview with him the other day. I was watching, I think it was a blind or something like that. Oh, man. I had to take it off. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, nah, I got to take this off. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> yeah, I, no, I saw that. <laughs> and they don't know it's just to you see the skill wise on match. Yeah, that's that's <laughs> oh, bro. Yeah, it's so hard to listen to. I told you he it's true what he was everything he's saying right now, like the way he was at, his placement, everything. Yeah. Like he took him to school. He was getting he was getting by with his speed. And no boxing. Like I don't like I don't feel like this guy boxed anybody. Garcia? Yeah, like he yeah. Like I don't feel like he like he has a trainer like put your hands up like this stop going like this every time they swing at you yeah stay in the pocket move like like bob and weave you can't bob and weave with your fucking back backwards how you gonna hit him how you gonna see what's coming if you keep turning your back like I, he he doesn't look like he has the basics yeah like a go inside a side sh 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 well, that's the thing. They, they they try to develop their own style, and it's like I said, he he completely leans on his speed. And yeah. when you got a guy that that knows your speed and can can nullify your speed, now you don't know how to box. Or how you gonna use your speed if I'm not there? <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. I'm over here. You could tell he kept ducking under his punches and and landing behind his back. I'm over here, homie. What you doing? Where? I hate the generic bullshit. 
Yeah. You're a great fighter. <laughs> Mayweather's like, yo, get away from this nigga. Fuck that. Bro, fuck I'll talk that. to my mans over here. That punch it must have been straight to the liver, bro. I think so. But that's the trick, though. Because he's mad little. And I saw that since the first round. He's like, he like, in the first round, he kept getting really low. I'm like, why is he getting so low? Like, all you got to do is hit him with an uppercut, right? Nope. He, anything he would throw, it would go right over him. Pew, pew. <laughs> and that's how he knocked him out. He threw a left hook, went over him. He turned around with it. By the time he came back. <laughs> yeah. Got him. <laughs> Oh no, you you was giving him too much respect because of the punch. Yeah, you got scared. Word, don't tell him the truth. Amen to that. He did come out to that Jesus name. Yeah, he sound like he gonna retire. Like, yo, I don't think I could do this no more. I want to thank this, and like he's saying goodbye. He don't sound like yo. You know what? I I knew I could beat him. I I want. I, if I wish I could get another try, but nah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight my way back, and I'm gonna get his ass. Sorry like that. <laughs> Word. He yeah, had the tear. He's like, I lost, and I told my mama, I'm gonna do this until I lost. I don't want to do this no more. And he just ran off. <laughs> I saw her boobies and she like my back. <laughs> my butt hurt her after the knockout. And he just ran away. Word. <laughs> what happened, dude? That was a good match, though. Mama, he hit me. It wasn't a boring fight. Yeah. I got what I wanted. Yeah, that second round was pretty good. Hell yeah. If only I wanted that second round for seven rounds. Word. But hey, man, it's 12 o'clock. We made it right on time. That's it. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, it is your friendly neighborhood knucklehead signing out. Peace, everybody.